Yo, what is up, everyone? Welcome back to our playthrough of Horizon Forbidden West. I'm sorry that the last stream ended very abruptly. The stream crashed, and so I was like, you know what? I'm done. Whatever. Because it was late anyways. And, ooh, a gold ingot. Damn. Cool. Um, Let's... We spoke with this dude, and I think the stream cut off around about when we were trading with him. So, yeah. Um... We'll just talk to him a bit more and then hopefully we'll be able to swim underwater soon, which would be awesome. So, uh, how does someone like you end up working for someone like Moreland? I work with Moreland. We got three equal claims in this venture. I saw one of his early shows. Back when it was... It was just him and his inventions. Works of flame, lights, and... Shadows, all kinds of gizmos. Never seen the like. But the man is all spectacle. No sense. Bleeds shards like, like, you get the idea. Without me to handle the finances, his dreams would be sunk. More sunk. <laughs> More sunk. Wish we were back in the claim. Plenty of normal shows to do without the... The salvage from this blasted place. All right, Lucy, no worries. And yet, you're here, in the middle of the desert, delving for his dream. It was a good one. But sometimes, a dream has to die. Wow, okay. This dream of Moreland's... Is going to get him killed. Let's say it doesn't. What happens after he gets the salvage down there? Then we put on the greatest show the world's ever seen. We'll have the greatest showman seating, uh, premium ale, the works. Uh, Moreland will do his his light spectacle thing. Uh, Stemmer will get their eyes a sparkling with his tails, and I'll be selling tickets. <laughs> it's, uh, it's a nice thought, anyway. He looked so excited for it. Norland mentioned you were showman. What? An ostrom can't be anything other than a, a, a delver, tinker, or drunkard? <laughs> okay, sure, we are delvers too, but that is not our main source of income. Mostly, we go town to town, putting on shows. These shows, what are they? What happens at them? Tales. And spectacle. Uh, uh, Moreland's got the technical know-how. Builds uh, all manner of inventions, know, right? twirly gigs of, of light and sound, cannons that, that, it looks that incredible. shoot fire and showers of sparks and stemmer. Keeps them enthralled with tales of adventure in the smoothest baritone. Oh, okay. Yeah, that. And you? How are Me? you, Count and Drekka? Who do you think handles the financials for the whole blasted thing? <laughs> those two, eh, those two might have the, the sparks, but do you think they know their way around shards? <laughs> do you think? No, they don't. All right, gosh. The Delm. So Moreland was down in this ancient city and- The three of us went down below. You? I can delve too. Right. And uh, then what happened? What do you think? Water rushed in, we ran. And Moreland built that blasted thing. He nearly got himself drowned. Twice. He... You want the finer details of his stupidity? You go ask him. I'll leave you alone. Do us a favor. Leave us all alone. Wow. What a bitch. We had a great conversation and this mofo, uh, what? Oh, the gauntlet, yes. I think I bought this as a new weapon, which looks really cool. After trying to learn OBS, you're tired. What do you need help with? Bolt blasters, yes. I bought new weapons. Yeah, look at this, actual like new weapons. That's a gauntlet and then we had, um. The warrior I thought we were finally going to get away from this place. Asthma damage is available now. Nice. Well, good thing that Aloy. I'm really up. well, thank you. 
Use your focus if that yep, hitting them with plasma. We'll see. Time the detonation. The longer their sojourn in the desert, the crustier the shard counter's mood became. This gun looks wicked. So what do I swim? Um, I think we need to, yeah, we need to get the parts from nearby. So we'll do that and then we can get him to build us a thing that allows us to bring up, breathe underwater, basically. Let me check my search. Resupply. According to Moreland, the herd should be south of here. What was that going to say? So are you looking to stream, dude? What the frick is that? A drone. Must be part of Cyclops. If I can get its data, I can reconnect it with the dome back at the base. So what, do I need to shoot it? But how to get up there? Oh, I see. Have to like grab onto it as it's flying by or something like that. Where can I climb? Here we go. I could have literally grabbed onto it here. Um, maybe I can climb something to jump onto the drone. Right, okay. I mean, we can climb this, but I don't think it's going to make... Whoa, okay. I don't think it's going to make that much of a difference. I quit? I'll just watch it. Really? Why? I could definitely jump from there, but I'm going to stay up here because it's going to move quickly. What the freak? Come. What was that, Aloy? Why didn't you grab? <laughs> what the freak? Why didn't she grab it? That's annoying. Oh, hello. I can't be bothered to do it again now. <laughs> I just said for the herd, I'll do it on the way back. Well, this is where Moreland said the herd would be. They must have moved on. Need like a regular. I need to pick up their trail. Better These are like the same bows. Hmm. I need like a regular we weapon. I'm realizing. Let me go to my inventory because none of these are like normal bows the hunter bow is the only like normal one let me equip it and get rid of one of these oh a campfire oh it's over there apparently i want to get this campfire as well i think this green channel will fetch a price There we go. Cool. Let's head over here. Seems like a storm, Zabruin. Okay, it's within this area somewhere. Yeah, it's very smooth. Yeah, you haven't even seen us fight yet. Um, where's it going to be? Who knows? Could be anywhere. Oh. It's 
So is me. And the heck. You know what, whenever I do this, I should really just hold it down. Grapple point. Grapple point. That's possibly it. I wonder if my focus can show me anything. How do we get in here? There's something there. Also something there. I don't know if that's what I need. Oh. There. Tracks should lead me to the herd. Okay, right. Here we go. Here we go. Much better. Let's call our mount because I can't be bothered to run. Sandstorm's blowing in. Just what I there's the herd. I should have the parts I need. Do I have to I uh, have to kill all of them? More machines? I do them first. Oh, hello, sir. I can barely see a thing. Um, sure. Oh god, oh god. Nice. Oh my god, could you not? You're gonna be weak to ice, right? No fire, apparently. Oh, the storm flipped up a sand spiral. Great. Ow, could you not? I hate these. Oh, new weapon. Cool, I like it. Oh my god, keep healing, please. Fire, fire, there we go. Um, let's try this one. There we go, nice. How did I miss? Seriously. What's this? Um, I want to try this. How are you still alive? Oh my god. Bro. I'm not giving up. How is this dude still alive? Literally one HP in the dream. There we go. Did we do it? Good. There's still another enemy, at least. These are all the parts I need, question mark? A scorpion? Yes. Sparker. What even is the part that I actually need? I mean, you're probably... One synthetic membrane. There we go. Okay, that takes care of the machine parts. Just gotta grab the compressed air capsule from Moreland's diving bubble. Could you stay away, please? Thanks, that'd be great. Let's 
so dynamic. So cool. Not worth using this. They're searching for me. Who's searching? Who? Is this where the survey drone is? It's like roughly here, I think. Ah, oh, yeah, it's over there by the castle. Yeah, the sounds are so good in this game as well. We're in Vegas at the moment, by the way, which is... I still love that. It's so cool. Let's climb this building again. I want to highlight it so I can see its track, but I, to be fair, we don't really need to do that for now. It is so dark in here. My God, so I cannot see a thing. <laughs> there we go. Up we go. Aloy, nice jumping. No, no. <laughs> What? There we go. <laughs> Got that eventually. Nice. Don't go, please. Okay, this time, hopefully we'll actually grab onto it. I don't know what happened last time, but Aloy was not having it. Oh my god, look at the, the tall neck. There Got we go. Just fly, forehead. I don't wait. Are you trying to say I'm fat? There. Nice. I can reconnect it with the dome back at the base. Oh yeah, these are the set I see, right? I see what it's for. Why is everything on alert as well? Like, is something chasing me that I'm unaware of? I think this is where I need to go next. I'm fairly sure. Great, swim back up, quick. close got the compressed air capsule i thought I we were finally going to get, to get away from this, this place thing, you know? well what can i do for you partner partner howdy partner i've got everything i need to build the uh the incredible diving mask i think diving mask is enough i won't quibble the workbench is all yours Oh, let's make this thing and we can breathe underwater forever. Oh, wow. There's probably loads I can upgrade as well. Bolt clip pouch. Yes, please. Special gear. Yes, please. This is my breathing thing. Nice. Traps. I don't really care. Ammo. Sure. Why not? Can I just do all of them? Create all the things I can create? Well, I guess it doesn't really work that way, does it? It's better to craft at the bench because it's better at management of resources, I think, or something like that. 
You would have thought there would be a way to like make as many things as possible basically, but apparently not. Not enough room in my ammo pouch. All this ammo I'm making. Okay, cool. I don't care about traps. I do care about weapon upgrades. I also need to put some... What's it called? On these. Is this a... Uh, oh, okay. Do I even have this? I don't even have that equipped. It would be nice to have it equipped though. I need to edit the coils. Whoa, there's a marvel. If it works, you'll let me try it? I want to get down there and get those embers. Assuming I don't drown. So what are you really looking for down there? It's hard to explain. Something that caused a malfunction in the apparatus that controls the old city. I think it started the flood. Well, I, I thought we started the flood. Like we sprung a trap. I don't know how we were detected. Like I said, the dancing lights around us changed, turned to sea life. There was this flash of red and the roar of water surging in. Wait, a flash of red? A red light from a spot near the grate on the floor where the water burst through. It was like a beacon. <sighs> or a morning. Thanks. That might help. I hope it does. And good luck down there. Okay. Time to see if this thing works. Let's swim forever. So far, so good. I can actually breathe down here. Yay, water temple levels. Let's go. I can see we'll have to climb our way back out. Diving mask seems to be holding up. I've never been able to swim this deep before. I'm surprised you're not commenting on your ears. Um, why are there projectors of like... This is weird. Oh, hello. There we go. Nautical lights. There must be Poseidon's doing. Cool. Very cool. That looks like a way out. Poseidon's down here, somewhere. Gotta find where it's hiding. Whoa! Shame. There's no way I can fight that thing underwater. I'll have to be careful. The thing was huge. This place is massive. <laughs> All of it's encased in a dome. Okay, no, this is not, this isn't being made in Vegas right now. This is definitely something like brand new. They got like an astronaut, they got... I'm wondering if this does exist already. A big fish thing, yeah, exactly. The current, not like this. Ah, this, right. Alert. Critical flooding detected. Automatic drainage controls offline. To execute an emergency purge, 
Manual reset of primary and secondary pump nodes is required. The purge can then be triggered at the pump maintenance station. If I do this purge and drain all the water, I can fight that big machine on dry ground. The purge. Looks like I have to reset a couple of pump nodes first. According to the map, there should be an access point for the first node south of here. Okay. This is so pretty. Yeah, this is insanely gorgeous, like honestly. Underwater? I tried to make an underwater game once. It did not go well. What the hell? They just have the Eiffel Tower coming like out of this? That is crazy. So Here's cool. The point. Should lead me to the pump node. There must be a whole network of these tunnels down here. Water lines for an entire city. This is basically the sewers. I mean, it pretty much is, right? I can't reach the ledge from here. Maybe there's something I can climb to get out. Is there anything I can climb? I don't see anything. Maybe there's another way out. Maybe over here. Yeah. There we go. down better swim back up and find the access point for the second node this redhead you speak of is off limits what do you mean base gods how are you oh i just hurt myself nice good job It is hot. Aloy, she's mine. <laughs> she's all yours. I mean, you can have her, dude. I love her, but not quite that way. I, I don't, you know. If Aloy tried it with me, she'd be barking up the wrong tree, I think. <clears throat> How are you, though? Thank you for the, map, the follow as well. The node should be on the other side of the dome. Don't notice me, senpai. Have you played this game, by the way? Like, how much of it have you played if you have... Oh my god, more enemigos. Access point. Should get me to the second node. The great borrowers. You don't see anything. It's still on the beginning stages. There is so much to this game, honestly. It's crazy. I wasn't expecting the game to be this large. And it's a really, really big game. I love it, though. I want to get past you, but... I'll go now.
the her swimming animation is so good dude it flows so nicely Oh my god, stop speedily swimming. There we go. <laughs> Stanley Chen just shut down the secondary node. No more water for the fountains. No more shows. No one left to appreciate them anyway. I'll never forget the city's grand reopening. The fountains had been done bone dry for years. But no one believed they'd ever return. So as the first plume arcs up in the dome, the music swelling, my heart soared right along with it. The city gave me a second chance once. Now it had one too. Wait, I could have played that? I didn't even realise. Ah, nice. Good job. Good job, me. I clearly need a run up. Jump. Running jump. There we go. I won't budge. Maybe that debris is weighing it down. What debris? Ah, this, right. Just ignite this. Okay, let's see if that helped. Okay, I've taken care of both nodes. Now we just need to activate the emergency purge at the maintenance station. <laughs> How did she do that? Oh, I guess the water was going down. I was like, how did she manage to do that? That like flip in the smallest amount of water. Yeah, I think you're going to have a freaking fantastic time playing the game, dude. According to the map, the maintenance stations should be at the south end of the dome. So I need to add that way. How inconvenient. Oh, don't notice me. Okay, good. Hit it with acid. Yeah, but you can't shoot underwater. can see this nice uh land is free returning this car to its original unchained unbridled american okay it's heading back good Let me mark all of these because these guys are very difficult to spot. I think that's it where the red's coming from. red light in that tower just look at the console i found earlier that might be the maintenance station but how to get in it looks like part of this building collapsed there might be a way in
Is this the way in? Looks like no. He saw nothing. Okay, let's see where this leads. Here we go. Ooh, a little gem, cheeky gem. I think I'm in the maintenance station now. I just gotta find a console to activate the emergency purge. Oh, this game is so gorgeous man holy crap i just can't even they have just done such a stellar job with the visuals Start for the stash. where did we need to go probably up here Ah, uh, yeah. Through here. Here we go. This looks promising. There should be a console in here. Oopsie. Here there. it is. Time to dry this place out. Is this really gonna work? I guess so. being able to swim everywhere in a way that did it <laughs> okay now i can deal with that machine guarding the door on the other end of the dome and once i get past it i can get to what's waiting on the other side of the door Poseidon. i guess the purge didn't get rid of all of the water Only thing left is power everything down at central control so i guess this is it one final walk down the strip and then it's lights out forever at least i won't be around to see it destroyed the odyssey will be well on its way to cyrus by the time the swarm gets here still my last memory of this place will be empty a city that's already dead was that another System thing? Shutdown, so almost done. i could have played that the only thing left is to power everything down at the control center so, I guess this is it. One final walk down the strip, and then it slides out forever. At least I won't be around to see it destroyed. The Odyssey will be well on its way to Sirius by the time the swarm gets here. Still, my last memory of this place will be empty. A city that's already dead. Stanley Chen was one of them. The Zenith. But he did so much for this place. He... He doesn't sound like the others. I'm well confused. Where am I heading? I'm lost. Is this the way out? Oh yeah, this is the way we came from. Here we go. The robot should be about, yep. This is so cool. Now we're 
heading over here. Might as well break my fall. Purge left these machines behind. I could sneak by them. Go with a big one first. I mean, I don't need to fight them, do I? But I think it's worth it, to be honest. Hurt me, please. Oh. Let's try this. Get wrecked. Yeah, we don't get many of those. That also reminds me, I completely forgot to put a coil on my weapons. Where do I edit coils? Here we go. This is one. Edit coils. Let's increase damage. That impact damage. Reload speed. Uh. Sure, damage cell and concentration mode, why not? Got that. We need to edit this coil as well. Yep. Increase damage. Yeah, that sounds good. And I think that is everything. Cool. Power is there, but we kind of just want to head over here. is through there but where did that machine go oh yeah the big big one Aloy it's a miracle oh, oh you're all dead okay no they're fine <sighs> come on come on hey was this you did you lower the waters yeah but there's a new problem that thing's in our way band of adventurers beheld the beast they knew what they had to do what are you crazy hush now she saved our death okay then stay up here and start firing when i engage Electricity, perfect. There's a lot of explosive parts. All the sacks are explosive. So. Stay right there, bro. I missed. Nice. Ah! Ah! 
Um, do I have... No, I don't have any special moves unlocked for this yet. Be nice to, though. That's a lot of water. This music is so good, my god. You know what? Let's use the piercing. There we go, nice. Nice. Leave your neck right there. Nice. So close. So close. Whoa. Down it goes. Nice. Awesome. I freaking love this game. Holy you crap. Oh, this game's so much fun. I freaking... Mm, it's so good. That was such a Come cool on, enemy. Get a move on. Everything's sticking. Ugh, damn this heat. Good job. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Where are we heading? Over here, right? Oh, the door magically unlocked. Nice. Oh, am I meant to speak with them? Oh, I guess so. Apparently. <laughs> Maybe it's the secondary objective. You guys all right? More than all right. This... You... We did it! <laughs> all the embers we could ever want, and it's all thanks to you. Very, uh, heartwarming. But maybe we can just, you know, grab what we came here for and get out before any more of those things decide to show up. Now, now, shard counter. Nothing wrong with a little reveling. Though we should probably let our flame-haired friend get going. I believe she has business down here, does she not? Right, of course. You need any help? I can handle it from here. Very well. Well, we'll start taking some of the embers upstairs. Holler if you need us. Thanks. Sidon should be somewhere beyond this door. Time to bring it home. What are all those noises? Through here? Sidon, where are you? Okay, Poseidon should be hiding in some kind of processor. I need to find a console to gain access to it. You can't Falling. glide? Okay, Definitely. sure, sure. You want me to run like a normie? Yeah. I should be able to use that console. Are we going to get Poseidon this quickly? No I'm way. Bring you home, Poseidon. We got it. Okay, that was way quicker than the other yes. ones. Mother. Elizabeth Sobek, Alpha Prime. We did it. I wasn't expecting it to be that easy. Okay. Got to bring this back to Gaia. I'm so surprised it was that easy, to be honest. <laughs> I thought there would be a lot more. Looks like taking Poseidon triggered a restart of the city's power system. So what is Vegas gonna come to life the again? Crew must have headed back up top. Carry, I bet. Oh, that's cool. Very cool. This is very Vegasy. Not 
much. Let's go up here. Oh, there you go. This is where we came from, right? Uh, how do we get back up? I guess we came from inside this building. This is so cool, man. So pretty. East Vegas. I didn't even notice. When everything was underwater, I barely even noticed any of this detail. That is a dead end. How do we get up and out? Oh, climbing. Oh, I thought I fell for a second. Oh, okay. That's really not what I wanted, but okay. Let's just climb you. There we go. Here we go. Vegas 2060 20 years ago this week Stanley Chen broke ground on one of the most ambitious construction projects in American history even though many Americans didn't want him there as he struck his spade into the barren soil the CEO quipped how resentment against Chinese political influence and had turned Vegas into a boiling hotbed of nationalistic sentiment but how his immense fortune had cooled that down, finally warming Americans to his idea of a new Las Vegas. Who would have believed at the time that he would become one of the most beloved figures of the clawback era, but Stanley Chen has always been one to defy the odds, literally. In 2035, during a meeting with his potential investors at the old Temple Ho Tempo Hotel, Chen watched in horror as his water filtration startup drowned before his very eyes, realizing too late that his once trusted lawyer had sold critical patent info to the competition. The resulting chain reaction of busted deals quit, whipped him out, leaving him with only $88,000 to his name. Only. I wish I only had that amount. Devastated, Chen decided to leave his future to fate. He went to casino floor and placed all 88,000 on a roulette wheel, number eight. It hit. The resulting 37 to 1 payout netted him nearly $3.2 million, enough to rejuvenate his dreams of starting a successful business. He threw himself back into his work, eternally thankful for his lucky new lease on life. Five years later, it wasn't Chen that needed saving, but Vegas itself. The hot zone crisis has strangled tourism. Years of ever increasing heat had dried out the county completely. Water in critical demand everywhere was now too expensive to import. Aband abandonment seemed to be the only option. The city of lights was about to go dark forever. But Stanley Chen couldn't let that happen. In five years of incredible success, he had turned 3.2 million into $200 billion selling water filtration technology that data corrupted. Damn. This man went from 88,000 to 200 billion. Stanley Chen. It started right here, more than 30 years ago, back when this casino was still called The Tempo. One big bet turned my face around, but now fate's dealt its cruelest hand ever. To everyone, I have to turn the lights out one final time, and the waters of my adopted home will at last dry up. Well, if a dream has to die, at least I can say goodbye first. Why it started right here, do I not play ago. it? Back when this casino was still called the Elevator. Temple. Man must have built One this before the place flooded. Turned my fate around. Nice to work. Now, nice I stuff is crude as hell ever to everyone. I have to turn the lights out one final time. And the waters of my adopted home will at last run dry. Well, if a dream has to die, at least I can say goodbye first. Another recording from Stanley Chen. Huh? 
Okay. Nice. Climb up that. Lovely. I'm jumping across to here. Oh, God. There we go. Oh, wow. This is where I was before. It's unrecognizable now that the water's gone. They must have powered up the whole city. What's going on out there? How much did all this cost? <laughs> oh, wow. Oh. Oh, the show my old gramps always wanted. There's another. Oh, wow. <laughs> His dream realized. His old gramps legacy ensured. Our hero beheld the sea of desert lights and wept at his good fortune. When I saw the embers as a child, I never dreamed they could be like this. Thank you, Aloy. Well, did you find what you were looking for? I did. And now I have to move on. Oh. Oh. Come back when you can. I got big plans for this place. I thought you wanted to put on shows with the Embers back in the claim. Oh, <laughs> no. This is the show. Oh, can you imagine? Folks from all over the land coming to take it all in. Plus, some food and a nice place to stay. Not to mention a variety of entertainment venues. Uh, don't forget. Games of chance. Plenty of shards to be had there for certain. <laughs> <laughs> A new dream, huh? I, um, I hope you make it happen. Goodbye, gentlemen. <laughs> this delve was a story for the ages. All thanks to you. It looks so cool. If Moreland and crew is going to stay, maybe I should come back and check on them later. For now, I need to get Poseidon back to Gaia. But I might want to find that Osram Tinker who's out on her own first. And with my new diving mask, I should be able to swim as deep as I want to. Once I find a place with more water. Cool. Dude, this looks so cool. Oh my god. The light show is so, so awesome. So this is how the city used to look before it got destroyed, I guess. This is a new Vegas. It's so pretty. I want to see the strand, not the strand. What is it called? I've forgotten. That is the stratosphere or something like that. You're back. Welcome back. I'm just in awe. This is so pretty. That's good. There, are, there used to be rides on this, but who knows in the new one, maybe they didn't have rides. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, anyways, where are we going? <clears throat> Let's head for our quest. Uh, where do we even start? Yeah, so Osram ran away. Let's do this. Wherever it is we need to head, we need to head that way. Okay. Let's go, bro. Oh my god, a sliver thing sight. There's a campfire right here. Cool. 
I'll just discover all the campfires along the way. That's not good. Sliver Fang. Oh, there it is. I remember you. That you could coil around a Thunderjaw. I don't want to fight you, to be honest. <laughs> that would be a lot to deal with. Oh, there's a campfire right here. Okay, cool. Discovered that. Let's, yeah, let's just head here. Fight? You want to fight it? I mean, it would be fun, wouldn't it? Weak to, ah, oh, nice. You're weak to the poison thing. That's a usable weapon. Reaction explodes. There we go. Nice. Stay right there. Whoa. Stay still, you bitch. No stamina for that. Get that. Ah, oh, I keep missing. Oh, lovely. I need to heal. Yeah. <coughs> Yeah, there we go. Oh, I didn't explode. I missed it. What else are you weak to? I want to hit your usable weapons, but I have no clue how, how to hit that. My God, this thing is deadly. I need to hit those. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Daddy chill. Hit him. Build it up. Nice. Heart's flying. There we go. Nice. Um, what else are you weak to? Fire. I'm very dead. <coughs> let's whip out the fire and let's get the power shots out. <coughs> oh my god, bro. These are apparently fire shots, even though they don't seem like it. Lord Jesus, chill, bro. Look at those nice. Flames. Whoa. 
god, the shake. Holy crap. Um, let's do one of these. Yes. Hit that weak spot. Explode it. Come on, we're so close, man. Did you not hit me? That'd be great. Nice. Come on, hit that weak spot right there. Nice. Now we hit some of your weapons here. Oh, I miss. Off some more of these. What version of the move? Brave shot. Yes, brave shot. Nice. That does so much damage. Hit the tail. Nope, miss. Don't have enough stamina yet. Can you craft midair? Oh my god, you can craft whilst gliding. That is broken. Uh, we are so close to killing this thing. Where are you? Here you are. You can still hit that weak spot, even though we've used it already. Nice. Nice. We did it. Beautiful. Okay, we should. I want to upgrade. What do I want to upgrade? I want to upgrade some of my weapons so we get those special moves. Yeah, because we have um, first weapon. That's different. It's not really that I care about. But there's a new weapon. Penetrating rope. Yeah, I mean, that would be good to get eventually. We have that. Spread blast. That's a bolt blaster. This would be great to unlock. Sustain burst. That looks really cool. Now that we have these weapons, before I didn't even have these weapons, I was a bit confused as to like how you get it. Yes, we need the power shredder stuff. Here we go. Triple shot. Yes. That looks cool. What else do we have? A bouncing bomb. I say we get this. Cool. Wow, you got some serious stream delay, the Apex. I finished him like a good 10 minutes ago. <laughs> that was good though. Um, yeah, we're still doing this mission, but that was a nice little, nice little side, side thing. I don't even know what I said. That was worth, that was she said. That, that was what she said. Um, uh, okay, cool. Cool, we are Gucci. Where are we heading? We're heading over here. Come here, bro. Yeah, hopefully that's caught you up. Are we in the area? We're in the area, apparently. Where the Osram ran away. The Osram I met said someone in their crew ran off in this Get direction. My rig. I should keep my eyes open. I think she's gonna. Yo, what's up, legendary cat? How are you? Thank you so much for the raid. How was your stream? What'd you play? What'd you get up to? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Into it. Back up. Oh yeah, we are fighting enemigos. Ouch. There goes the pace. Yes. 
Hit it like that again. Yeah, hit it from the back. Hit it from the back. Hey. Ow. What can I... What are you even weak to? Hurry up and show me what you're weak to. Electricity. Okay. Apparently. Die. There we go. Oh god, don't hurt me, please. What are you weak to? Fire or water? What is this? Why are you pooing all over me? Um, fire. Let's go with fire. I should probably help that person out, huh? <laughs> come on, come on! Stay away from my rig. I need acid. I'm gonna hit you. You're gonna blow. There we go. Is it safe? Did they get to it? Please be intact. Please. I should make sure she's okay. Let's repair you. Basically, mint gold mal malfunction malfunction failed to success. <laughs> Fair enough. Sounds like a, a good time. <laughs> Um, you're over here. Hello. I was like, what is this effect that's going on? It's my like ultimate thing. It's still going. Supply drop. Oh. All right. Why? The spike is still intact. Rig's still playing. You okay there? You took out those machines. I'm grateful, but you should go now. There's nothing to see here. Rude. So this rig of yours, it's receiving sound through that wire from the thing up on the cliff, what you call a spike. But the message is only a fragment, and you're trying to pick up the whole thing? How did you figure all that out? Why do you look like Ray? I've learned a few things in my travels. If you want, we could talk about it. Maybe I can help. What you do seem to so go ahead. Hi, boss. How's it going? <laughs> Thank you for the raid. I was very distracted by my phone. Bean raid. Hi, Twitter T. Twitter T. Sorry. Boss, how was your stream? Are you playing some Minecraft today? Thank you so much for the raid. I... Uh, lots of dialogue. Let's go. How did you first hear the message? I used to be a smith up in the claim. Wasn't an easy life. A lot of hard work without much to show for it. Then one day, I heard a whisper coming from a steel rod. Faint, like the last fingers of steam coming off a cooling forge. When I moved the rod around, the whispers got louder. I did some tinkering, built my rig, and did my best to follow that sound. Further west I came, the stronger it got. Then I found that spike up there. When I hooked up my rig, Spike. The words were clearer than ever. Isn't it an antenna? What do you think the message is? I don't know. There's something sad about it. Feels like it's from one lost soul to another. I'd sure like to know what it means. Your rig's impressive. How does it work? Well, like you said, the spike up there seems to capture the sound. It travels by wire down to my contraption. 
I, I put some coils in there and a light sheet of metal that vibrates, making the sound louder. I'm not exactly sure why it works, but it just does. And you set it up out here all alone? I'm not the trusting type. Pretty much everything I do is all alone. <laughs> Sounds like me, a loner. You're no ordinary tinker. Didn't used to be a tinker at all. More of a metal worker. Came from Mainspring. I can well to seem so fine you could barely see it. Not that I ever got any credit for it. You see, up there, you've got to be a man to get ahead. I once had a shot at joining a first-rate crew with one of the best forges in the claim. But I didn't get the job. My own brother wouldn't vouch for me just because I'm of the female persuasion. Well, that's a bit sexist. That's what we call misogyny. Anyhow. And that sucks. At least out here, I don't have to worry about any mainspring men talking down to me. Bye, legendary cat. Thank you so much again for your raid. Everyone say bye. You're playing Valorant, so in and off chat. Poggers? Have you tried out Yoru since the update? I really need to play Valorant again. It's been so long since I played it. Sounds like you're still mad at your brother. Some days I am. Other days, I miss him. He's passed on, you see. Oof. He didn't have the guts to go against the blast of the bellows and vouch for a lady. Even his own sister. It was cowardly, and I told him so. In fact, I told him we weren't family no more. But over time, I've had cause to regret it. He wasn't a bad sort. He knew how to make me smile when he wasn't being such a lout. I'm sorry he's gone. Yeah, so am I. I mean, Yoru got completely, like, redone from the ground up, right? So it's perfect if you are Yoru main. I used to be a Yoru main, but he just wasn't, like, good enough to do anything. Let me have a look at that spike. I might be able to pick up more of that message. How? Let's just say I have a rig of my own. I didn't know Nora were tinkers. They're not, but I am, in a way. Be right back. I love Aloy. Well, okay then. I guess. I hate when people say I guess. Just follow the wire to the spike at the top. Uh, and then please, just don't break anything. I'll break it all just to piss you off. How about that? I thought a dyer would be interested in this. How the heck are we going to climb this? I mean, there's a lot we can climb, so... Better get climbing. Ooh, one hell of a trail. Gotta give her credit, lugging all that wire up a cliff wall. There's a spike. Might get better reception if I'm next to it. Enduring victory. Interesting. Can't seem to get a fix on where the signal's coming from, though. Well... Better let the tinker know I got a bit more of the message. What is that? Oh, it's a thunder jaw. Wow, it's so far away and you can see it all the way from here. And there's the... Wait, there's a tall neck there? Oh, that tall neck is also very far away. 
Holy crap, we can see so far. It's insane. We can see all the way to there, my god. One heck of a view. What is that over there? Have we even been there? I think we have. It's probably that outpost. Anyways, let's head down to our friend. This ought to be a good shortcut. Oh, I could have literally just done that. Your rig is picking up an old world message. A recording of some kind. Thought as much. Did you hear more of it? A bit. It was recorded during a, a war. A bad one. Maybe that's why it sounds so darn sad. There's something about it that makes me think of my late brother. May his ashes stay warm in the forge. Not sure why exactly. I, uh, I still can't get a fix on the source. Well, the words grew stronger when I got out here. What if you moved the rig now? Try to see if you can get a stronger signal elsewhere. Even if I could dodge the Tanakh and the machines, I can't lose that spike. Nothing else pulls down the words better. Okay. If it's an old world message, then let's try old world methods. They used to pinpoint signals by listening for them at three different spots. The taller, the better. And then they combined the information and used it to find the source. And you can do that? I think so. But your spike is only one spot. I need two more, both up high. Oh. Well, there's a big bright tower in the Tanakh territory north of here. Yeah, that should work. I have another spot in mind near a place I'm uh, camping. Wait. I don't know your name. Or why you do all of this for someone you just met. Aloy. And because I want to know what's out there. Same as you. Silga. And when you find it, Aloy, I'd be eager to hear what it is. Okie dokie. Ooh, can we make anything? No. Really. We can have two weapon well no, I don't need to upgrade either of those. Okay. Let's go here. What's this? Why am I going this way? Um okay, that that was that. Cool. Well, it's a fireplace. There must be a fireplace nearby. Apparently not. That's the nearest one. Let's go here and then we can teleport to somewhere else. Um, let's teleport here, finish this mission. Hi, kid. How are you? Climb up the tower. Okay, there's a tower? Which tower? Where? Where'd you get that cord, meat? What tower? This is so confusing. It must be up here. Oh, right. Yeah, I see it now. <laughs> it's literally right next to it. Good. How are you? I'm fantastic. Thank you. Just climbing, doing some Aloy stuff. You shouldn't be jumping. You shouldn't be meddling with me. 
just a little higher. Almost there. Uh, okay, bro. Huh? Nope, that's nope, that's not possible. But hey, I'm not complaining. I don't think, yeah, I've never climbed this before. Okay. Let's see if I can pick up Silga's signal. Well, I got more of the message, but not enough to find the source yet. Climbing the mountain where my base is should finish the job. Okie dokie. <clears throat> Let's head down to there. There's also a new quest here. <laughs> Hello. Oh, it's you. Take it from a girl who grew up in the wilds. Birds don't provide much conversation. That's for sure. How are you doing, Aloy? Well, better than you, I think. At least I'm not chatting with animals. What's wrong? Meat here flew in yesterday with this in its beak. It's a cord that the Tanakh children use to carry their training swords. The kind of thing one of our young doesn't lose unless something bad has happened. Uh oh. I checked around. Are there two Turns of that out bird? a kid is missing. Wandered off the day before last. Search parties turned up nothing. <laughs> Gotta tell you, I'm not in the mood to lose one of my people. Especially a child. Let me see that thing. There's a bit of quartz on here. It's probably sand, some dirt, and clay with a red hue. Sand, dirt, and red clay. Oh my god, double icon. I know a spot where all three meet, just south of the settlement. Will you meet me there and help check it out? How convenient. Maybe use that relic of yours. The way things have been going, I can't trust this to anyone else. I'll get there as soon as I can. I can always count on you. Sounds like Yara is feeling isolated. <laughs> I would too if I was speaking to two birds at the same time. Now it's fixed. Okay, so we can do that mission, but I say we finish this one first. Let's go to the fire, please. Something's holding up. That's her. Honor. Let's see. There we go. Now let's head up this mountain and hopefully finish the rest of the signal. I see you, champion. Sit, please. If you walk by, really? you'll miss out another on a good trade. Another rumor? Fine. What you got to tell me? Heard the lowlanders have been fighting rebels by the coast, west of the grove. If you're still helping the chief handle those scabs, you might want to talk to Kregella at Tide's Reach. If I make it out there, I'll see what I can do. If you need a merchant, here I am. Now we need to climb, yeah. This mountain. The southern face is my best bet for a climb if I want to get more of Silka's message. Just gotta look for a path. Well, this is as good a path as any, apparently. Oh, fun. Right. Fight or sneak past. Leap Lasher. I can actually... Can't I... Yeah. Oh, what the freak? What happened to my focus? Have I been blocked from using my focus? Drop, 
No. Um, let me use my smoke bomb actually. Gonna stay right here. Because I wanna override one. There we go. Overrode, get overridden, bitch. Nice, good job. One's better. It's not going to be on my side for much longer though. What the heck is that that's causing my thing to go crazy? I have to get higher to try and pinpoint Silga's signal. I can't even use the pulse, so I don't even know where to climb. Or can I do it from here? I should be able to use it soon. <laughs> Nicely done. Oh, it's this. You're causing it to go crazy, right? These radar pods. Pretty cool. I've never seen one of those. Annoying, but cool. Just let me shoot you normally. Cheers. There we go. Thank you. Cool. I can use you again. Now, where are we heading? Along here. Ooh. Along here and then along here. Yeet. Nice. Yeah, like I would have known I'd be able to climb this without my... Focus? No way. Oh, I guess I'm climbing here. There we go. Quite a climb. Oh gosh. I have to get higher to try and pinpoint Silga's signal. You weren't lying. This is one hell of a climb. <laughs> sure, 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 Eli. You're insane, girl. Right? Is <laughs> tall. These jumps are so unbelievable, but hey. If anyone can do it, do it, Aloy can. Anyone can do it. Looks like I have company. Frost ammo's not gonna do much. Fire, okay, cool. Same with you. Um, I don't think I can override these yet. 
I know I can. Kill this one. Oh. <laughs> Help me. It's fallen. Get Rex. Oh, I can override you. Oh well, too late now. You didn't even help. You're useless. Anyways. The airplane, airplane. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's that that you should have got right. Can we update that mods? Uh, where am I even? Where do I need to climb? Oh, up here. Okay. You're triggered. We can give you five gold. Five gold. You're really triggered over five gold, brother. Now, how the heck do we get up here? Oh, here. My window is open and it's still boiling in here. Beautiful. Have we made it yet? Oh, we'll mess up. Surely this is a vantage point. Maybe not. Now what do we do? Surely we can do it from here. Oh, kill the machine. Are you kidding me? What machine? Ah, oh, there's one more, isn't there? Is this it? Oh, it's too far away. You're kidding me. After all this climbing. Let me kill you. Uh, I couldn't aim down anymore. Sad. Oh, snow's dampening sounds. What? How was? Ah, uh, yeah. There we go. Come get me, bro. I'm up here. Oh, okay. Did I kill it? No way. I killed it. Still need it. to climb higher. There we go. Still need to climb higher my ass. I'm already here. Stark one for two to enduring victory Reno. Supply drop beacon echo. Pull. I pray you get this safely. I left a note for you inside. There. Found the signal's origin. It's not too far from here. I just need to get to it. I'll get a nice view if I glide down from here. Sure. I don't question gliding. I love gliding. Yeah, this game is freaking amazing. Not gonna lie. I love it. Oh, I think it had to load because we traveled so far. So that when there's two very similar, well, no, they're actually like the same answer straight up. So we need to fix it. The Apex Lucy, either of you here to help fix this question? The sickest game? Oh, no way. Yo, that was so quick. I'm happy. 
Do you like them? It's always good to have extra. Are they everything you ever dreamed of? <laughs> oh, I don't need that arrow. I just want a normal arrow. Oh, no, no, no. We should fix these anyways, because we'll have to deal with the repercussions in the future anyways if we don't deal with it, so. It's worth dealing with it then and there. A rebel outpost right here. Oh! Let's finish this first. My focus is picking up the signal that Silga found. I'll need to clear out the machines before I can look for the source. Come on, kill it. One more hit there. Nice. More stamina. One more shot right there. How are you? What? Sick as a trash. The only one to business cards. Well, I'm sorry, buddy. I need to top up. I can't top up. Nice. There we go. Nice. What is that? Oh, hello. I can't make any more of those, which is sad. Shh. What is that? That was a stalker thing. You saw nothing. Um, what am I doing? Oh, I need to kill the machines. Okay, that's fine. You're weak to acid. Okay. Okay, let's use... Oh, I don't have that one. Give me that weapon, please. Please. Ah. Ouch. Still in the street. Please, let me kill you. Oh god, that's gonna hurt. Hi bro, how's it going? There's so many enemies. Run away. Stop aiming. Aloy, what the frick are you doing? Aloy? Aloy, thank you. <laughs> what the frick happened there? I couldn't stop aiming. That was so weird. Ugh. Okay, cool. Um, let's head up here. Oh, you lost me. Oh, stop hurting me. I don't even know what to use, dude. This thing is not very weak or not. Oh, 
Okay, finally. Still more enemigos. And then just these ones. Anyone else? There's at least one more person. Well, at least you like the business cards. <laughs> Why the heck are these last robots? Let me just do this. Why am I running around? There you are. Now, oh, how to get to you? But I'll need to deal with these machines first. No, you won't. I think there might be something between these rocks. But I've got to deal with the machines first. No, you don't. What do you mean? There are no machines. Yo, what are you talking about? There's literally nothing here. I think there might be something behind those rocks. But I've got to deal with the machines first. Uh, why? What, what happened to sneaking past? I'm so confused. I don't even know where these machines are, bro. Oh, hello. Oof. That was brutal. Absolutely brutal. Are we done? All right. Time to find my way to the signal source. Good. About time. That looks promising. Secret tunnel, secret tunnel for right. the mountain. Into the water. Secret, secret tunnel. Ooh, hello. I've honestly forgotten what we're even doing right now. Source of the signal. I think this, I've just gone off on a tangent, bro. I don't even re there remember what we're doing. No, what's inside? Signal spike. Oh, is this the signal? It's still the same mission. Oh, I couldn't raise you via focus. I hope this gets to you. Somehow, you the key to the stand at the Rubo line. Just wanted you to know that all the bitterness is water under the bridge. Oh. That's why it glitched. I only remember the good things. And I'll think about them. When the darkness comes. Sounds like she really cared about him. Silga will want to know about this. And she'll definitely be interested in the transmitter inside that's been sending the message. It has been one heck of a journey. All for this one mission. Um, let's head for this campfire. And then we can fast travel back to her. Sigala. Is that... What is this? Oh, it's an outpost, right? Oh, it's right here. That's a level outpost. I'll have to find whoever's in charge and take them out. Sure, we can do an outpost. Why not have some outpost fun in the meantime? Um, I still can't make that. So. Oh. 
Didn't even get to see me take her down. That soldier with the heavy armor must be the leader of the bunch. Chain reactable with fire. You're weak to the purple thing. So let's do that. Movement. Damn, they saw me. There! Stop there! I need help here! You hear that, alarms? Whatever it takes to bring her down! Get wrecked. Gonna explode in three, two. Get wrecked. Give me that weapon. My weapon. Ow, you bitch. Ow. I will tear you up. Where are the others? Oh my god. Some here. I can't see now. Is that it? It's just these two left. There's got to be more, surely. Yeah, there's one there. That's it. It's just these three left. Easy. What makes you think I'm here? Oh god. Hi, you yeah, came from there. Yeah, I can fight and die. Get right. <laughs> We're out of weapon. We're out of bullets. Um, let's just do. Oof. I can't even see our head. Oh, close. This outpost won't be causing any more trouble. Nice. Cool. We did it. Loot the outpost leader. Where even are you? Here you are. Hello. Unlock the tags. I'll have to figure out what to do with them later. Cool. Now, let's just use the thing that we even came for. Came here in the first place for, which is the campfire. Fast travel. But we have to, we had to go so far for this. There's absolutely a fireplace there, I know there is. Upon hindsight, there's a fireplace there and there's a fireplace at the other one and I didn't even go to either of them. But it's fine. Give me my mount, please. Thank you. And let's try and get this fireplace up here. Shelter. Chance to rest. Check my gear. Chance to rest? I don't think I've ever rested before. Aloy rests? Never. Oh, let me stock up because I really need to. I think I have actually rested before I'm lying. Not much. Again, not much we can upgrade. Let's make it daytime. Why not? Oh, look at that. We got a nice view of Vegas. Let's go to morning. Is my girl just sitting, staying awake? Okay, bro. <laughs> the chosen one never sleeps. You're right. Ew, what is that? What, what is... Hello? 
What is this? Is that like maggots or something? Ew. Disgusting. Anyways, um, let's head for where we actually need to head. And the big surprise is the it's fucking easy. bass is fucking raw! That one bass, bro. <laughs> Hello. Did all Aloy. your stuff. The words stopped coming from the spike. What happened? This is what was speaking to your rig. It's old world equipment used for communicating over long distances. The message must have shut off when I took it, but I heard the note the voice was talking about. What was it? During an ancient war, a woman was trying to deliver supplies to a man she knew. She wanted him to know that their past disagreements didn't matter in the big picture. That she'd be thinking of him. How cute. When the end came. Oh. I guess she and I are kin of a sort. I wish I could give my brother a message like that. Tell him that I forgave him. He would have wanted that. Oh. I know. This man, the, the old one. Did he ever hear the message? I don't think so. I guess that's often the way of it then. But still, with the power of that device you found, the sender had hope that he might have heard it. What a feat. To send messages near and far? Can I keep this? It's a treasure. Of course. Thank you. Sometimes people don't ever get to hear what they should. But with this thing, maybe I can get them talking to one another. From Mainspring, all the way to who knows where. Hey, I, uh, I found a few more things in the supply cache. Might be able to make something out of them. Can I use your workbench? Sure. Yeah, right over there. Anytime, Aloy. It's all yours. I think I know just what to do with these parts. A new weapon? Spike thrower. Ooh. Cool. We did it. Out well. Can't wait to try it. Nice. Now what was the other thing I wanted? I wanted more of this. More new moves, but it looks like I can't. <laughs> Sad. Potion. I don't really use potions. Valor on impact would be quite lovely. Even though I don't get hit often. That would be quite nice. Smoke bomb capacity. Never use smoke bombs, so that's kind of a waste. What other things could we upgrade? Oh god, my leg. I shouldn't stretch like that. <laughs> Uh, I never, never use these. <laughs> Quick one. The trip caster is pretty cool. And the rope looks pretty cool. But other than that, that branch really has nothing going on. Cool. Glad we did that mission. Now, what's next? Sea of Sands, return to base. I say we finish this, um, this main mission. Give Guy the water. Um, so we need to head to a fireplace. There's probably one here, so let's head here. Is this the way? Yeah, 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 this is the way. Is this the way to Amarillo? What's up here? 
Climb, climb, quicker. Look at the beautiful sunshine. Ah, oh, is this what I want? Here I come. Oh, a well. Cool, let's check it out. Oh, wow. Okay, cool. This is like super deep. Look at how many of them there are. Wow. Squeeze through the crack. My god. Okay, damn. There's even more. Nice, we did it. Oh god, my claustrophobia would be kicking in so much trying to squeeze through that. See, Aloy is small enough to fit through that. Me, I would get stuck and then I would start freaking out, panicking like crazy. That is actually one of my genuine biggest fears, claustrophobia. I'm so claustrophobic. Okay. Well, other than that, let's try heading here, I guess. should be a campfire over here and then we'll be able to teleport oh it's a shell so cool and we can even go through here more secrets never I hear a valuable item behind her. Lovely. Nice. More secrets. Secrets everywhere, dude. Okay, we are heading. I kind of want to try that, but we're not doing that for now. We're heading back to base. Back to basics. <laughs> Get it? Because base. I'm just going to stop. I didn't even realize you could teleport here and it would take you basically straight to the base. I normally teleport at the other fireplace on the other side of the door. Of the mountain, I should say. Hi, friends. I didn't like the way you sing it. So you like hearing me put your Utaru music? I sure don't. You sound like a dying lawn leg. <laughs> You're back. Now that you have those control cores, are you ready to reboot the land gods in Plainsail? Not yet. Gaia told me the reboot code has to be altered using data from the cores. She updated my focus with software to accomplish this task, but Apparently, it's very complicated. It'll take time. Well, let me know if you need any help. I will. Your mom, your mom got you white chocolate? It's your least favorite kind of chocolate. What? I, I love white now. chocolate. Farewell. Okay, let's give Poseidon to Gaia. Welcome back, Aloy. I see you have recovered Poseidon. If you want it, go. I'll email it to More you. Yes, please. Dump. Oh, cool. Did we get to see it pop up or something?
Whoa, I like this one. that's so cool. You can choose your background. And this is Vegas. Oh my god, this is so cool. I love it. I'll be right down. Aloy, I have managed to unlock additional rooms within the facility. Got it. More skill points. Four. Nice. Um, let's get more of this. What does this do? Oh, that looks cool. Nice. Yes. How many levels are there? I have no clue. Could be like a hundred. Who knows? Gaia has wallpaper engine, exactly. Hey Gaia. Me again. What's up? Hi, Saucy. Welcome back, Aloy. Where shall we resume? Um. Uh Wow. Loads of questions. Oh no. Oh no. Big dialogue coming, Soz. <laughs> what can you tell me about Demeter? Demeter sows, fertilizes, and tends to plant life. So once I bring it back, all the blight out there will start to get better. While permanent restoration requires the abilities of Hephaestus, I may be able to improve conditions in the region for a while. However, a word of warning. Like Aether and Poseidon, Demeter's response to my query was highly irregular. Alone and frightened, it may have taken measures to assure its security. Okay, I'll keep my guard up. The missing subordinate functions. What can you tell me about them? Artemis rewilded the Earth with a variety of animal species. Eleuthia was responsible for gestating, nurturing, and acculturing a new generation of human beings. Apollo was tasked with preserving, organizing, and disseminating vast archives of human knowledge and cultural achievements. Unfortunately, all archived Apollo data was purged on the 2nd of February, 2066, by order of Ted Pharaoh. Pharaoh, huh? I really hate that guy. Understandable. Didn't we speak about this he already? He have been pathologically narcissistic, impulsive, and unstable. All three of the missing functions have already served their purpose, or were prevented from doing so. Do you still need them? Restoring their remaining elements would increase my heuristic processing density, empowering my overall function. Unfortunately, as we now know they are in the possession of Far Zenith. Attaining them in the short term is very likely impossible. I guess our best shot at recovering them is by taking over the Zenith base. But we'll need Hephaestus and a bunch of combat machines to do that. Correct. Were you able to make use of Poseidon? Yes. Many rivers, streams, and lakes associated with the regional watershed have been detoxified. As a result, red algae growth levels have seen a marked decline. According to my data, however, it appears a localized occurrence of red algae continues to persist near the coast. Maybe I'll look into it when I can. Yeah, we need, um, we actually need two more, so we need one more and then it's the final one. So Poseidon spent the last 20 years hiding out in Las Vegas. From the data I found, it seems the city had an advanced water reclamation system. Is that why Poseidon went there? Most likely. In an effort to protect itself, Poseidon sought out a safe harbor where it could access water supply functions. There. Buried and encased in a protective dome, it could guard against any threats. 
Like three Osirum showmen? I suspect that was not the first time it felt the need to repel trespassers. So, once Hephaestus has been recovered and merged, you'll regain the capacity to mass-produce machines at cauldrons around the world. Yes, and to program their behavioral routines, or even control them directly. So you could build an army of machines? Attack the Zeniths and take them out? It is in my nature to take any and all necessary steps to preserve We've life We've definitely on spoken Earth, about this before. So yes. Once I, I could design, given the nature of, I must admit, no matter how aggressive. That's good. Indeed. Yeah, we definitely spoke about that before. I don't know why they're highlighted like we haven't spoken about it before. You mentioned that the superstorms have subsided. Is that ether at work? Yes. Thanks to oh, Wilich's nice. capabilities, weather patterns in the local region should mostly stabilize for the time being. That's good. Well, that's a relief. Be nice not to have to fight my way through a storm anymore. Hey, what's I will up? To stabilize the atmosphere and for Scapone. As as I can. Did I say your name right? Also, Blue, how are you? Sounds like we. Sounds a lot like how we got here, bruh. <laughs> Ain't them machines how we ended up in this situation? Kind of, but the machines are saving us as well. Why did Aether take up residence in an ancient war museum? As with the other subordinate functions. Ether needed to install itself on a processor with adequate storage and power. The one in the museum appears to have been sufficient, given that the holographic displays were still active. So Ether was assured it could stay for as long as it needed to. Correct. Though it is curious that it chose a place surrounded with the ancient ruins of aircraft. Maybe it also felt at home there. Well, don't count on me saying it right again. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it was Ernst Capone. Right. Now, that's not difficult. I'm glad I managed to get it right. Hell yeah. <laughs> Sounds like you're messing with Forbidden Machine, but maybe, maybe. I swear we spoke about all this. Beta believes the Zenus want to use the terraforming system to start over. So they can I know we haven't spoken we about this. Further supporting our hypothesis. But why? Given their technology, they could wipe out the tribes of the world by easier means. And if they're the same people who left Earth a thousand years ago, wouldn't they want the biosphere to be as it was? It is likely they adjusted to different planetary conditions in their colony on Sirius. They may be trying to recreate that environment here. Turning Earth into a new Sirius. Their own personal playground. Oh, I'm glad you're excited for it. I'm excited for the tournament tomorrow as well. A reminder, actually, if any of you haven't um, signed up for the POQ tournament tomorrow, you can sign up there. You'll need an account, a POQ account. I recommend signing up with Discord because then you get free tokens that way. So sign up with Discord and um, it is indeed tomorrow at, it's not 8.30, it will be 8 p.m. I need to say 8. I need to update that command. Um, let me do that. So the Zeniths are the same people who left Earth. Physically immortal. How'd they figure it out? From what we know of Far Zenith. It is plausible that prominent geneticists and engineers were offered a place aboard the Odyssey in exchange for their expertise. Given enough time, technology, and resources, any challenge can be overcome. Like how Minerva eventually generated the deactivation codes for the Pharaoh Plague. Exactly. The Zeniths. Gerard, Eric, Tilda, Verbena. Beta said they were some of the most powerful people on Earth. Do you know anything about them? Unfortunately, no. My personal database is limited to those who worked on Zero Dawn. Additionally, it appears Far Zenith was quite secretive about their members. Only one, Oswald Dalgard, was ever publicly known. 
Right. Here's the spokesperson, back at their old launch facility. What we can conclude from your and Beta's experiences is that the Zeniths are ruthless in pursuit of their goal. To protect life on Earth, they must be stopped. The extinction signal didn't just wake Hades. It made every subordinate function self-aware. Why? I have wondered this myself. So far as I can tell, Hades was the sole target, and the partial sentience imparted to other subordinate functions was incidental. A signal that precise would require thorough knowledge of the system. How could the Zeniths know that? From the records on your focus, it appears Far Zenith had an informant during the development of Zero Dawn. Hank Shaw. He was supposed to steal a copy of the system for Far Zenith, but Elizabeth and Travis Tate caught him first. Yes. It is likely Far Zenith acquired knowledge on the system's design through him, despite his failure. You played it multiple times. You'll probably know, like, most of the answers. Because it does repeat questions after a while, but I still suck, even though I've seen them before. I, like, keep getting the questions wrong in Trivia Matter Part 2. So from what Beta told me, I guess we can assume the Zenith's technology is powerful in all sorts of ways, right? Yes. As your encounters with them amply demonstrate, they appear to make extensive use of robotic servitors. Further, they seem to be equipped with some kind of protective energy field that shields them from harm. This, but Whoops. that weapon the rebels use stripped their shield somehow. Throughout his every defensive technology has a while we lack the end were I to absorb a Festus and utilize it to create a large no shielding could withstand. So there's hope. Oh, yeah, we definitely we definitely spoke about that before. Our progress beta. So I guess Beta's here to stay. I gave her a focus. Told her to talk to you to see if she can help. She's not what I expected. What were you expecting? I don't know. Someone more helpful, I guess. And less pessimistic. It is true, she overestimated our progress. However, it is also worth noting that her confidence in your abilities emboldened her to escape the Zeniths. I guess so. Give her time. She may yet come around. Hopefully. How's Katalo doing? I have detected that the loss of his arm still deeply pains him. In an effort to remedy this, I have discussed a potential solution with him. I believe he will want to fill you in on the details. A solution? I'll check in with him when I can then. How are things around here? Zoe has been studying the morphology of her land gods in an effort to understand their sickness. Without the abilities of Hephaestus, I am unfortunately unable to correct their programming. However, due to Zoe's perseverance, we may have a workaround. Yeah, she filled me in. It sounds promising. Varl and Zoe seem to like spending time together. Indeed. <laughs> While studying old world data, Zoe discovered references to a dietary lifestyle known as vegetarianism. Oh. She appreciated the similarities with Utaru practices and encouraged Varl to try out this lifestyle. And oh. how did that go? I believe they have agreed to disagree. <laughs> Me and every non-vegan. <laughs> I like it because I can speak about myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love Fibbage enough about you because you get to learn about the people you play with as well and you don't need to know people. Like, you just get to learn. And yeah, it's, it's great. I love it. How's Erend handling things? He is becoming increasingly accustomed to use of the focus. After an initial incident. What did he do? He unfortunately crushed his first focus as he attempted to affix it to his temple. <laughs> Amongst a number of Osaram curses, I believe he also blamed the focus for being dainty. 
He has given repeated assurances that it will not happen again. How the well, hell? Good thing we have a lot of extras, I guess. How many extras do we have? So there's a few people here now, and they're learning all about you, the ancient world. Almost like what was supposed to happen before Apollo was purged. Yes. While the loss of the Apollo database was catastrophic, there is still much that can be gleaned from the data you have uncovered. For instance, Varl has been reviewing the last recorded entries from those who perished during the Pharaoh Plague. Hearing their hopes and fears made him quite somber. Anything I should be worried about? I do not believe so. I have elected not to intervene, to allow him to process this on his own terms. Ah, huh? what? I don't understand. Unscapone. Chilver rhymes. Something rhymes. Uh, silver rhymes. Hmm. I feel like you're being smart and I'm not. <laughs> Gaia? What was Elizabeth like? Her presence is interwoven with my memories. The moment I came online, she was there. We exchanged greetings, names, then set to our task. It was the first of many conversations. I enjoyed being in her company, listening to her stories. She was my creator, my guide. Your friend? Yes. When I reviewed the data on your focus, I was saddened to learn of her fate. Though I am glad she made it home. I deeply wish she did not have to be alone. She was okay with that. She gave all of herself. The only one who could. Thanks, Kaya. Ah. Zero so, Dawn. Project Zero Dawn. The greatest minds in the world. All working to build the terraforming system while the Pharaoh Plague devoured the planet. What was it like? Personnel worked in rotations at all hours of the day. Resources and technology were secured from across the world. Within a month of the project's conception, I was launched and began my education. Elizabeth encouraged me to spend time with the rest of the Zero Dawn staff. She said it was important to experience many personalities and perspectives to aid in my emotional development. What were they like? Scared. Hopeful. Determined. They were hurtling toward technological achievements on a scale never before attempted. I owe everything to their dedication. Old World Discoveries. So the Hades Proving Lab, where I found the Gaia Colonel. It used to be a Pharaoh research facility? Yes. Prior to appropriation by Zero Dawn, the facility was used to engineer and test advanced computer viruses. It appears to have been one of many research initiatives by Pharaoh Automated Solutions. I guess it wasn't enough to build automated killing machines. He wanted viruses to infect them with too. So, a while back, before the battle at Meridian, I went into Banuk territory. I discovered another Banuk. AI there. One not related to Zero Dawn. Cyan. It was created to oversee operations for a volcanic stabilization project. And it spent the last thousand years in isolation. I'm guessing you didn't know about it? No. From the data on your focus, it seems that Cyan was cut off from the outside world. An effort by its creators to protect it from the Pharaoh Plague. Any chance it could help us now? I have already attempted contact, with no success. Given its previous experience with accepting an outside network request, I imagine it is unwilling to do so again. Right. Because last time Hephaestus enslaved it. 
Well, that's too bad. I think the two of you would have had a lot to talk about. The processor Ether was installed on was part of an ancient war museum. A memorial to something called the Hot Zone Crisis. Do you know anything about it? My knowledge of historical events was unfortunately lost with the Apollo database. However, climate data indicates a peak in regional temperatures in the 2030s. Such conditions would see extreme prolonged droughts, an increase in dust storms, ah, and loss ah, of habitable ah. landmass. But they wouldn't have built a museum oh, in the wasteland. That's hot. Well, so oh. I guess things got better eventually. Yes. Data suggests that temperatures return to average levels in the clawback era of the 2040s. Because of stream delay, your timing sucks, the Apex. <laughs> I'm pretty sure whatever they were talking about that was hot. There was an ancient tank embedded in the bulwark, time. buried under a bunch of boulders. <laughs> Any idea how it got there? During the Pharaoh Plague, the U.S. military resumed the use of human combatants, as automated machinery was unreliable. It is possible the vehicle was part of a pre-automated war fleet. So they fought against the Pharaoh machines in the valley, until the mountain was blasted apart and buried them. When I dove down into Vegas, I found data about the man who built the dome over the city, Stanley Chen. It turns out he was a member of Far Zenith. But if he loved Vegas so much, why did he abandon it? Why not try to save it? The Zeniths at their core have proven to be exceptional survivalists. Faced with overwhelming odds of extinction, they chose to flee. Even still, what he achieved water to the wasteland an entire city brought back to life a thousand years later the whole place was still on standby just waiting for someone to come along and wake it up and it was very cool when we did wake it up when we were at the facility where we found beta there were records that said far zenith were researching embryogenesis i know they traded their ectogenic chambers to zero dawn but why were they researching it in the first place at this point, we can only speculate. Perhaps at one time they meant the Odyssey to be a colony ship, necessitating such technology. As their goals evolved over time, so did their areas of research. So they got more selfish as the risks of staying on Earth kept rising. So this facility, the Regional Control Center, it was meant to oversee the terraforming system? For the local region? Yes. Had humans received their education from the Apollo database, they would have then been guided here to assume operation. As that never happened, this place remained vacant. Until Minerva decided to settle here. So I guess this room was meant to keep an eye on conditions outside? Yes. From here, the facility's operators would have been able to observe weather and machine activity in real time. It may be possible to restore more of this room's functionality should you find and reconnect additional camera feeds. I'll keep a lookout. What's up, Blicky on my stiffy? How have you been? Good to see you. Good to see you. Okay, we are done. See you later, Gaia. Bye, Gaia. Until next time, Aloy. Gaia, play Despacito for a frick's sake, brother. <laughs> How are you, Blicky? Good to see you. How have you been? The old ones painted their faces with something called makeup. Like the card show. <laughs> Why? Yeah, it beats me. It Honestly, something to I asked the same question. As it does to my people and the Tanakhs. I just think my face says it all as is. That's all. <laughs> that it does. They used to wear makeup. Crazy. Um. 
What's new, Buttercup? Where'd Patalo go? Can we um fabricate new things? Nice. We can override these bitches finally. Ah, so close. Sky Drifter would be really cool. Okay, we need to find some cauldrons. Got banned in the Discord server for saying I got eaten alive by rabbits. Like, damn. What? That's weird. It's very strange. Um, I feel like there's talk to Val. Oh, okay. Where is Val? Oh, where is Val? Apparently Val's out there. What other quests do we have in here? Oh, all of them are on hold. We need to speak with Val. Okay. Let's speak with Val then. Hi, Varley boy. Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. She found that recording from the data on your focus. She's been watching it a lot. I think it helps calm her. You know, I used to watch this a lot too. Whenever I wanted to take my mind off things. Daddy sure does love his little big... But there's something you need to tell me? While you were gone, I came down here to check on her. Then we started talking. Right, Beta? She's been thinking about how to capture Hephaestus, studying the data Gaia gave her. But we started talking about some other stuff. You know, just getting to know each other, right? And then she told me that one of the Zeniths might be different from the others. Tilda, you saw her at the Hades Proving Lab. Go on. On the way to Earth, the Zeniths never showed their faces. My servitor caretaker referred to them as my benefactors and promised I'd meet them someday when I had learned enough. And then, one day, a data channel opened in my training interface. In it, Tilda was waiting for me in a virtual replica of a house on a cliff overlooking the ocean. It was beautiful. She showed me paintings, books, media files. We met there in secret many times. But a few months later, it stopped. Is that Aloy breathing? Can you tell us why, Beta? I found some data about Tilda at the Hades Proving Lab. I think she was a liaison between Far Zenith and Zero Dawn. She knew Elizabeth Sobek, that's for sure. Maybe that's why she reached out to you? What is this breathing glitch? I hate it here. We're gonna have to like reset the picture. <laughs> the what picture in the game. What else you about Tilda? She liked to talk about her paintings. What about herself? Did she ever talk about her life on Earth? How she joined the Zeniths? Something like that? She never said much about herself, and she hated it when I asked too many questions. But I think back on Earth, she was an expert programmer, given that she built a data channel the other Zeniths couldn't detect. Is there anything else about her that we might be able to use to our advantage? She was the first real person who ever bothered to speak to me. I wasn't really assessing her for strengths and weaknesses. All right, miss. You said that Tilda reached out to you using a data channel? It appeared in my training interface as another assignment. When I opened it, there were a series of intermittent glitches. I realized they formed a transpositional cipher. Instructions on how to open up a new virtual space. 
When I entered it, my training interface disappeared, instead of the usual holographic teachers and files. I was in a perfect recreation of her home. And you're sure the others in this never knew about it? To them, it looked like I was still in training, toiling away, alone. So this secret virtual space looked like a house with an ocean view? I could see white caps and hear waves crashing on rocks below. And there were gulls crying outside. Inside, Tilda had frames that showed off her favorite paintings, changing at intervals to match the light. There was an armchair she liked. She'd sit there and gaze outside while I looked through her things. We spent hours in that house. I never wanted to leave. You said Tilda showed you paintings and let you access media files? Every time we met, she showed me a new painting. I, I think she was Dutch. All of her favorite pieces were from their golden age in the 1600s. Portraits, allegories, ships at sea. She had so many. Did it interest you? I liked her media portal. It had so much more than my training interface. Clips, shows, hollows. My favorite was this one called Second Time Around, about a family whose kid comes back after disappearing during the hot zone crisis. Right, but did this portal have anything about the Zeniths themselves? Anything we could use? No. Any information about them was redacted. So Tilda set up a secret virtual space where she could talk to you, a house on a cliff. Then later, she cut you off. But other than the fact that Tilda knew Elizabeth, you don't know why she did those things? I don't, okay? I thought of every possible reason that would make her leave, but whatever I did wrong, I don't know what it is. When I finally met the others, she ignored me. Acted like the data channel never existed. None of this even matters. Tilda is the same as the others. It won't help us defeat them. Okay. Let's leave it at that then. She's so like, I don't know. She'll jump out of nowhere. Nothing like Aloy. What's wrong? I'm trying, Varl. But she is tough to take. I'm out there in the wilds, risking my life every day, and all she can do is hide in there and tell us how hopeless it all is. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, she's had a rough time, but she is really not helping right now. Hmm. You always seem to be on top of everything, so I sometimes forget about what you've been through. I mean, it wasn't that long ago you were so banged up you couldn't even walk. About that. When I pulled you out of the water back near the Proving Lab, you were muttering Rost's name. You never talk about him, but he raised you, trained you. You must miss him a lot. Of course I do, but I don't have time to think about that now. I need to get back out there. Okay, I'll keep working with Beta. Gaia says she knows a lot about Zero Dawn. And maybe she just needs some time to adjust, and then she can help us with Hephaestus. Sure. But I won't hold my breath. No, keep talking, please. I'm making my sandwich. Quick! Now I gotta play. <laughs> Let me find someone to talk to quickly. <laughs> so, now we head to San Francisco, I think. Oh, talking. Let's go. More talking. Oh, yeah. Hey, Aloy. Uh, it's everything all right? Yes, because now I get to Seemed talk like you to and you. Varl were down at that basement for a while. Yeah, everything's fine, I guess. Well, okay. Uh, what, what can I do for you? <laughs> that is... Okay. That is a lot of dialogue in this game. It is insane, but Still I like sifting it. sifting through loads of data. Yeah, it's interesting. There's lots of 
words. I, I thought maybe I could try finding things with more, you know, pictures in it. Not much luck there, but I, I did find out about these uh, hollow films, like images put together to tell a story. Uh, they were made to look like they were the real thing. You know, the Osaram like shows. I bet they pay a lot of shards for those hollows. It seems like you're getting a hang of this data thing. Yeah, it's been helpful. When I can make sense of anything. I did find the old ones enjoyed a good brew like the rest of us. Only they let machines serve the stuff in bars. They even let the damn things cut you off before you saw the underside of a table. Uh, that's half the fun. Now, you won't see me letting a robot serve me a pitcher anytime soon. That's crazy. So a robot wouldn't serve you if they knew you were about to get drunk. That's kind of funny. How are things going around here? Hey, you tell me. Varl's new girlfriend tried to kill me earlier. What did you do? I made one joke about how they, you know, eat grass a lot. How does anyone fight with nothing but tree leaves in their stomach anyway? From the looks of it, the Utaru. Yeah, well, I wasn't expecting it to be that fast. Just try not to get hurt. I see someone's been playing strike. I'm just trying to get some practice in. Helps take my mind off things. You should try playing Katalo. It's a Tanakh game. Maybe you'll learn something. Oh, sure. Tanakh. Sure he won't try and kill me if I win? Pretty sure. See you tomorrow. And Skipo, thank you for chilling. Maybe it's one of the three laws. And then trying to protect you from being drunk. Or oh, drunk dialing your ex. I love how he's like mocking vegetarians, basically. <laughs> Do I smell ale? Yeah, I brought some over from Chain Scrape. Hey, with everything that's been going on, I thought we could all use a drink. Besides, there is nothing that brings people together like a good brew. That's what my sister always said, anyways. Hey, you're more than welcome to have some. Maybe another time. Yeah, that's only true if everyone drinks. Some people don't drink, so... I should get going. <laughs> Back to reading, I guess. Do be careful out there. I will try. Hi, Val! Hey, got a sec? Of course. You feeling okay? I was just thinking about Beta and all that time spent with the Zeniths. To think someone would make a person just to lock them in a room to use when needed like some sort of tool elizabeth sobek sacrificed herself for the world and yet they have no trouble treating beta like a slave another reason we have to stop them that's kind of effed effed up to be fair when you say it like that i was training discovering something new about our past every day when we first met, you asked me if I ever wondered what this world looked like when the old ones lived here. I thought it was strange at the time, but a lot has changed since I left the embrace. Now I'm just trying to make sense of everything I thought I knew and versus everything I know now. The change is hard, but it gets easier over time. It's hard to believe we're dealing with the original Zenus. The same ones that left for Sirius a thousand years ago. To live on for so long, it doesn't seem natural. Because it's not. That weapon we found where Beta was hiding, any chance we can use that against them? Silence made sure that wasn't an option. Why would he build something to hurt Far Zenith, yet allow them to capture you? With Silence, there's always an angle. We just don't know what it is yet. What do you make of this Tilda the Beta was talking about? Well, the way she described it, I can't shake off the feeling that Tilda wanted something from Beta. Maybe because she's Elizabeth Sobek's clone? But whatever she wanted, I don't think she got it. If we knew what it was, maybe we could use it to our advantage somehow. Uh, I don't know. 
I don't think Tilda and Elizabeth were on the best of terms. Oh well. At least we can take some comfort in knowing the Zeniths don't trust each other. Maybe. You brought up Rost before. I do think about him. You know, he was all I had. And he brought me up the best he could. Not only that, when Hades discovered who I was and sent the Eclipse after me, he sacrificed himself so I could survive. But that seems like ages ago. So much has happened since. What I'm doing now, I don't think he could even begin to understand it. The Sacred Lands were all he really knew. So I can't let myself dwell on him. Not with everything I have to do. I understand. Sometimes, when I think about my sister, about what she would have become if she had survived the proving, it hurts. And I just need to bury it for a while. But only for a while, Aloy. You can't ignore it forever. Memories always come back. The ones that matter, anyway. I know. But for now, the mission has to come first. Fair enough. I completely forgot. His sister died in the proving. I should get back Damn. out there. We'll be here if you need us. Hi, Zoe. Aloy. Hey, how's everything going? I am well, but Varl told me Beta's having a hard time adjusting to life here with us. I wish there was something I could do to help. I'm not sure any of us can. A tree won't bear fruit in a day. We'll do our best to make her feel welcome. Are you guys training with Erend as well? If you count trying to stick a spear in his gut as training, then yes. <laughs> I've been told. Please tell me you weren't being serious, though. Of course not. Good. I was going for a couple of broken bones. He called the Utaru leaf grazers. Laughed at the idea of us simple farmers being formidable fighters. Before I knew it, he and I were battling it out in the common room. The man is slow, but he can throw a hammer around. Don't look so worried. We're evenly matched. For now. Next time he's going down like a load of boar dump. Just try not to kill each other. Injuring his pride should be good enough. <laughs> I like her. Is there anything I can help with around here? Hmm? Oh, no. We're doing fine. Are you okay? You and Varl have been friends for a while. I like to think so. I was wondering... What do you know about his mother? Oh. He's right there. That bad, huh? Why do you want to know? He's spoken of his sister, Vala, but I noticed he avoids talking about his mother. His mom's a bad She's bitch. She's the war chief of the Nora. Best warrior the tribe's ever known. Tougher than a thunderjaw. Yeah. But she could be pretty harsh at times. Yep. I see. That must have been hard on him. Thank you for telling me. I feel silly not being able to ask Varl directly. I wouldn't worry about it. He's probably afraid Sona will scare you off someday. I'd like to see her try. Oh, okay. Okay, go. Found anything else combing through that data? Varl and I have been looking into the animals of the old world. Apparently, there used to be thousands more species roaming around than there are today. Yep. Can you imagine that? I'd give anything to see them, even as holograms. Though I know that without Artemis or Apollo, that may prove difficult. At least I can find comfort in knowing Gaia used many of them as inspiration for her machines. Her memory honors them. Yeah, it's crazy to think they haven't seen most life on Earth. Like, there's only boars, there's only like a few different animals that the machine or Gaia was able to make. What are you going to learn next? I'm not sure. I asked Gaia for suggestions, and she brought up data you found on something called a... Museum? From what I gather, the old ones would store knowledge in them for all to see and learn from. 
yep. like you've done here for us. Maybe one day more people will be able to use this place to learn the way we have. That sounds crowded, but nice. That'd be awesome. The Zenith did a number on Beta. But she seems to trust Varl. I still can't believe she told him the Zeniths are immortals. Old ones who cut themselves off from the cycle of life and decay. I've never heard of anything so selfish. To deny our dying bodies to the Earth. To doom the life that would bloom in their place. It's despicable. That's one way to look at it. I'm all for immortality, to be honest. <laughs> it's, it's a thing. It's coming, by the way. I should get going. Good luck on your search. Where's our friend? I think this is, yeah, this is our room. The old ones use holograms for everything. It well, I'm for anti I wonder if at some point aging in a way. Is that way out? Where the heck is he? This is my room, isn't it? Looks like Gaia was able to unlock that door. Well, it's not even anti-aging, I don't There's a lot think. of equipment in here. Gaia, what was all this for? This room was designed for management of the facility's vast sea banks. From here, control center operatives would have monitored new crop rotations into the automated farmlands, now known as Plainsong. I see. Okay, well, I meant anti-aging and um, if you didn't get into an accident, it doesn't slow it down. You can stop aging completely and it wouldn't slow it down. It would just stop it like you wouldn't age and therefore, in a way, you're immortal. Obviously, you can still die if you're like hit by a train or something like that, but that's what I mean by immortality. According to this console, there are still thousands of plant samples stored deep below the facility. I could ask Gaia about them the next time I talk to her. Is your focus acting up again? That's fine. I can take a look at you. We can talk to Gaia right now. Yeah. Usually work the bite. Welcome back. Hey, Gaia. I'm back. So I see. Huh? Oh god, there's more to talk about. So I talked to Beta. Didn't learn much. It seems to me you did. From what she describes, the Zeniths controlled every aspect of her life, even as they shunned her. This Tilda was the first person she ever had contact with. An abrupt severance of such a relationship would be very emotionally damaging. Hey. Yeah, I guess you're right. Zenith identities. The Zeniths. Gerard, Eric, Tilda, Verbena. Beta said they were some of the most powerful people on Earth. I think Elizabeth knew one of them. Tilda. Did she ever mention her to you? No. Elizabeth often spoke of her work, or told stories of her mother and her childhood. 
If she knew this Tilda, she did not disclose it with me. What we can conclude from your and Beta's experiences is that the Zeniths are ruthless in pursuit of their goal. To protect life on Earth, they must be stopped. Yeah, that new room. I found some data in one of the rooms you unlocked. It mentioned that there are still functional seed banks beneath this facility. Why is it there? My predecessor was tasked with reconstituting the biosphere with primary and secondary plant species. Had everything gone according to plan, humans would have eventually been able to introduce tertiary species, including new crops. Can we access them now? Unfortunately, it will have to wait. I require control over the machines in order to access and distribute the preserved seed stock. And for that we need a Festus. It's something to look into later then. Cool. When I'll we get off. a Festus, Fair. it'll be good. Then we can get more plants back and it will be beautiful. Okay, cool. All our talking, I think, is finally done. So, let's head for our next mission. At least we're making good progress for the game now, I think. Demeter is ages away. You got a rumor for me? I What's see that? you, champion. I spotted a group of Osram salvagers wandering the edge of the desert near the southwestern border. I'd report it, but I don't think they'll last long. If the machines down there don't get them, the storms will. Oh, that's kind of you. Sounds like those Osram could use a hand. I'll keep an eye out for them if I'm down there. You shouldn't miss this chance to trade. Huh. Where are we heading? It'd be cool to go to a cauldron. Hunting grounds there. My god, dude. There's a survey. Oh. I oh, know it's a black box. We haven't really been around here at all. Okay, that is ages away. How many side quests do I have? The deluge. Didn't I do this? No. Meet Talana. Seeking an old Tanakh prison called the Rock. Wait for Zoe to complete the reboot code. Lightning Hunter Bow. Ooh, that'd be nice. Let's see if we can do this mission with Talana. Oh wow, that is that's like far. <laughs> that's super far. Holy crap. Um What about The deluge. We still, oh my God, everywhere. We need to like fast travel and then run to it. Okay, let's do this deluge thing. Let's see if we can get it going. Hello. I want to discover as many question marks as I can as we go. Oh, there's a survey robot. Another Cyclops drone. Gotta grab its data to reconnect with the dome back at the base.
I like the track. How far up do you go? My god, this swing goes everywhere. I have to jump onto that drone to get it down. Oh, I've already highlighted it. Um. Ah, that would be a great place. Don't go! Wait, stay right there. Can I not? Oh, come on, brother. Brother. Why aren't you letting me climb? I guess I gotta glide onto that. Nope. Apparently, it's like, no, you can't, you can't climb that. What are you doing? Push forward. Who's they hiding out me. there? <gasps> oh. 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 Oh, get wet. Hey, did you hear that? <gasps> Ow! Sure? Huh? Death won't come swiftly for you! Ow. Wrong move! There we go. So, that's just how she sounded to me. Whoa, Jesus. And she still held on? That is insane. Sure. This will make a good die. Okay, where will be the best place to grab this thing? Maybe there? It depends where it stops. Of course you wouldn't. Of, of, of course you wouldn't grab on. Rather. I thought, ah, it's probably going to stop here, but anyways, it's fine. We'll just admire the sunset in the meantime. Oh my god, this game. Look at how pretty that, oh, that was gorgeous. Wow, the sun faded away very quickly. <laughs> Hi, friend. Going down. Oh, I thought you were gonna miss. I was actually gonna cry. Okay, gotta grab the drone's data. Nice. Okay, that was just a side thing. What else do we need to do? Let's keep heading here. Where's my, where's my mount? Oh, hi, babe. Hi, babe. Plow horn site. <coughs> wow, that is a lot of redness. A hunter killing machine. More deadly than the normal one. <coughs> Laters. Shelter. There must be a fireplace up here. Maybe not. This must be the village Zoka was talking about. It looks like the whole place flooded. Maybe from a recent storm. I wonder if anyone made it out. Best check around the shore. Ugh. The waterfall's thick. Polluted. Yes, this won't help the water shortage in Scalding Spear. There are a few survivors on that overlook. I should see if they're okay. Huh? 
Hi. Is he all right? Uh, he will be. <sighs> there. But what about the others? I remember her. Let me worry about that. Rest now. I'm Natika. You're a long way from the east, Outlander. You're Natika. So this must be Bleeding Mark. What's left of it? How do you know this place? The Inker's apprentice and Scalding Spear told me to find you. He was worried something happened to your supply caravan. Well, as you can see, we have more important problems than delivering ash blood. What happened here? The last storm caused a deluge that brought down half of the mountain. The mudslide barreled right through the village. As you heard, we have many missing, but I need to keep watch on these two. I can take a look around. If I find anyone, I'll send them your way. Much appreciated. And if you see an older soldier, grim-faced, goes by Kentok, uh, tell him... Tell him I'm here. Okay. Might be able to use my focus to find any survivors. Baffle point. Really? Let's try going over here. Uh, <laughs> Imagine swimming through that. She was like, this is polluted. Can anyone hear us? Where are you? We're trapped in this tower. Flood blocked the way we came in. There's a ladder at the top, but we can't reach it. Okay, I'll find a way to get to you. I need to get to the ladder at the top of the building. Maybe there's a way to cross over from the broken one next to it. Where can I, like, stand up? Because I can't do much from a swimming position. Unless I can go underwater and there's a way in. Doesn't look like it. I oh, know, maybe here. I'll dry off. Eventually. I'm confused. Doesn't look like there's a way to swim into the broken building. I need something to get me over the metal wall and inside. Thanks, Aloy. Uh, things are actually helpful like what she says really helpful actually i mean there is that there but i can't shoot it from here it's too short how the heck do i need to like climb this maybe and glide over She doesn't want to climb anymore. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, we can do this. Maybe, hopefully. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Yes. There's a ladder on the other building. I can make that jump. Stuck. Maybe I can use my weight to make it drop. Uh, sure. Whoa, whoa! No! That was our only way out! Everyone okay? You're not one of us. Sorry. Yes. We took shelter in here when a mudslide swept through the village. But debris blocked the passage we came in through. That ladder was our only way out. But we couldn't reach it from here. Don't worry. I'll find us another way out of here. Do you know what happened to the others? 
Before we ran in here, I thought I saw a few of our comrades climbing up a watchtower on the north side, near the grotto. I'll look into it. As soon as you're out, head for the shore. Natika's waiting on an overlook there. So she survived. Good. We'll join her as soon as we have a way out. Okay. Sit tight, for now. Okay. Here we go. Boom. Nice. Good job, me. But how do I jump there? Oh, do I need to like bring it over? Well, caster won't work on that. And how the heck? Oh. It's like, what, what am I meant to do? There we go. How'd you do it? Okay. You should have a way out. Thanks. We'll head to the shore in a moment. It didn't look like Kentok was with this group. Okay. Better find this watchtower on the north end. The north end, okay. What's here though? Nothing apparently. Oh, right. That's actually where I need to go. I mean, we could climb here. Why not go up this way? Let's see what's up here. A thunder jaw site. Where is it? I must fight here. This will break my fall. Hey friends, how's it going? What are you the doing? Here. Oh, 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 this way. oh, nice. <laughs> on you okay, oh god here comes enemy goes actual enemy goes plow horns With acid. Oh my god, bro. Help me out. I'm stuck. Oh, Jesus Christ. Could you maybe attack the robots and not me? That'd be great. Wait to acid? Okay. Yeah, 
kill each other, that would be cool. Hit right there, that's explosive. Daddy, chill, chill, chill out, please. Nice. One more shot like that, and then you're dead. Please stop gunking all over me. It's actually kind of rude. There we go. Nice. Oh, oh my lord. Okay. You've gunked all over me again. Hit that right there. Oh, no. Fudge. Nice. Whoa, I love that brace shot. It's so good, man. Actually so good. The last one's all the way over here. Why did I come here again? I honestly don't even know. But hey, that was fun. I enjoyed that, even though I got my ass kind of handed to me for a bit. Hey, Think friend. <laughs> no, I'm not hiding. Oh, no. You dodged me. Uh. Ooh. Hey, bags. Okay, let's fill up on this. And let's... Um, Where were we even heading? There was something here which we never discovered. What's this? Ooh, it's a cave. A sunken cavern. Oh, hello. That's strange, I might trade for something good. Was that it? Just one? There's no, that's got to be a cave. There's no way. That's it. Oh my god. I thought I was about to breathe underwater and find loads of awesome stuff. Oh, there's a way up there. Is there a way to climb? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Well, I guess that was it. Hmm. All that for that. But hey. We got some other things out of it as well, which is good. Okay, let's head for here. It's disappointed, isn't it? I oh, know my disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. Machines must have moved in after the flood. Net are as under the hey, bro. A friend, yay. Hey, I'm up here. Huh? I'm on it. Weak to fire, weak to fight two. Yeah, let me set you on fire whilst you're underwater, because that makes sense. Oh, why is this thing so fast? Jesus. Oh, God, hi. She 1000% would die from boulders. that. Break the support beam, crush the machines. Whoa. Daddy, chill. 
Oh, God. Come here, please. I need, like, my regular bow. Let's use our enhanced shots. Crush him with the boulders. Shoot the support beam. Oh, oh God. Where are the other boulders? Oh no, I should not swim. Not against these guys. Oh, there's some there. Yo, bro, check out behind you. It's awesome here. Yeah, come hit me. Get wrecked. Nice. Ah. Oh, ow. Oh. Oh. Ah. Stop, stop. You're freezing me and it's not cool. Right there. there. Should be safe for the north now. We're coming down. That was a sick roll. I love taking this down. That actually was really effective. Did so much damage. Yo, what's up, survivors? Is everyone okay? Better now, without snap maws prowling around. You sure know how to fight. We saw some of our comrades stuck on the eastern cliffs. They could use a hand too, if you're willing. Okay, I'll check it out. Have you seen Kentok? Natika asked me to keep an eye out for him. Last I saw him was before the mudslide hit. Okay. Head for the shore, on the other side of the village. Natika's there with the other survivors. Will do. Thanks again. Cool. Let's head here. I need as many berries as I can get because I'm actually running out on these now. I will say the berry management in this game is a lot better. Before, you didn't have a stash, I think. So if you gathered like 12 berries, that was it. Like you couldn't gather any more. And then you'd be stuck in a position where you keep running oh, out of I berries. Go. But luckily, um, because you have your stash, every time you collect anything more than you can carry, you can just refill, basically. Why am I... Oh, I am heading this way for a good reason. I was like, why am I heading this way again? Hey, you. Forbidden... Outlander. Forbidden Weast. It is the we Forbidden Weast. Down. How are you, Feral Butch? Good to see you. Oh. Uh, hold on. I'll figure something out. I need to find a way for the Tanox to get down from the cliff. That big crane could help. If I can get it into the right position, I could make a bridge for them. I think I needed to climb that ladder, so I'm we're gonna... blocking the base of the crane. Oh. Maybe I can clear it if I pull that out. Didn't even see this. How's your day going? I, little, but I must be stuck on something else. Underwater, maybe. My focus can help me search. That's it, right? Oh, I guess we could go in here. Okay, maybe not. Let's go up on the other side. Could be something here. There, more rubble. Igniting that fire, and we should clear it. Do it. 
Have you played this game at all yet, Feral? That was convenient. Now to lower it, right? Okay, cranes in place. Now, how to lower it to reach the cliff. I should take a look at the bottom of the crane's arm. See if there's a way to move it. That's a shame. Yeah, it's it's really, Looks really like good. There's something weighing the arm down. I've got to get out of the water to get a better look at it. Looks like there's something weighing the arm down. There. If I pull out that beam, it should remove the counterweight and lower the arm. I should try a different direction. I don't think I can pull the beam from here. I have to get up higher. Okay. You're saving for a gaming PC? Ah, oh, nice. Yeah, they are extremely expensive, so I don't blame you. There we go. Oh, damn it. I'm stuck on something. I better climb up and take a look. Whee! Let's go through here. If I detach those cables, the arm should drop the rest of the way. Just use it, I guess. Um, yeah, let's make some regular bows. This thing's about to drop! Watch out! We're clear. Blood of the Ten. How'd you manage to do that? Before you go, a word. I don't know how you did it, but thanks for the rescue. Everyone has the Is same hairstyle, okay? though. His legs snapped against some debris as we were making a run for it, but he'll live. How'd you get stuck up here? A mudslide tore through the village in the last storm. This ledge was just above the flood when we got to it. But by the time everything calmed down, the water had receded, leaving us stranded. And we couldn't leave a fellow soldier behind. Can you make it to the shore from here? Natika's there, tending to the wounded. Natika. Thank the ten. We'll head for her location. She'll know what we should do next. Thanks again, Outlander. With Snuff got drip, they do. They have crazy style, not gonna lie. Is that it? Okay, return to Natika. Is this, uh, it's almost a place that we haven't explored, but we've explored a lot of it now. We definitely didn't explore this much before. Natika. Okay, I think that's it for survivors. I didn't see Ken talk among them. I should head back to Natika. I don't know. Oh god. The cat ugh. This looks worse than the River Thames, bro. Like ugh. How can you swim through that with your face and everything? Jeez. Aloy must freaking reek, mate. She is gorgeous, but she must stink. Rest now. Aloy. Thanks to you, these soldiers are safe. But where's Kentok? I didn't see anyone who matched his description. Do you know where he was when the storm hit? I was the last one to see him, just before. I told him I wanted to leave this place to pledge my blade to the chief's guard, but he refused to discharge me from the squad. All Tanakh are stubborn fighters, but Kentok is more so than most. So I walked out. I was coming back from the opposite ridge when I saw the mudslide. You were coming back to make amends. I must find him. If anyone can survive such a storm, it's him. You said Kentok is your squad leader? 
I've trained under him ever since I was assigned to his squad. He's tough as a shell snapper. Unforgiving as the desert. But my blade is quicker, deadlier because of him. And he taught me to fight for duty, not just glory. To serve something greater than yourself. Yes. And yet he wants me to be tethered to this place. Rather than fulfilling a greater purpose with the Chief's Guard. You said you wanted to pledge your blade to the Chief's Guard. Is that what the Marshals are? No. The Marshals travel the breadth of the Clan lands, enacting Chief Hikaru's will. The Guard remains at the Grove to defend it and the Chief. But like the Marshals, only a handful are chosen for such an honor. So why did Kentok not want you to go? He claimed that the greater honor was to serve my squad and clan. But all we do here is gather supplies for ink. How can that compare to guarding the Grove? The Chief himself. So a mudslide did all this? Must have been quite a storm. We've had more and more of them over the last few years. Torrential rain, lightning strikes, winds that rattle the metal towers. But this last one was the worst yet. This area used to be as arid as the rest of the desert. The storms have changed all that. There's a water shortage in the capital. Could this help? The wound in the sand is low? Guess we're not the only ones dealing with problems. But unfortunately, no. This water's poisoned by ash blood. Undrinkable as machine oil. The Inker's apprentice in Scalding Spear mentioned you exchange ash blood for water. It's the way of the desert. Where other villages hunt for food or machine parts to trade with the capital, we collect rocks. Important rocks. The clan relies on ash blood <laughs> to Important. understand. <laughs> How can they record their glories without our supply? I can take another look around the village. Where did you last see? Natika. I'm here. Where's Kentok? Did he make it? We're going to find him. He saved me. Pushed me out of the way as everything collapsed. But then the flood took him. Towards the gouge. The gouge? It's an ancient passage that leads deep underground. Come. I'll show you. Natika. We need orders. We're exposed out here. Only half of us can hold a blade if machines come. What do you want us to do? Go. The gouge is in the hillside, northwest of here. I'll catch up when I can. What are we going to do now? Let's get a couple soldiers posted as lookouts to start. Well, Understood. I guess you just have to be prepared to die. <laughs> go to the go gouge. Go, go with the gouge. Good use of this. It's on this side we want to be. Ah, hello. That must be the gouge. Looks like an old mine. There's a lot of tiny broken engines. Maybe Kentuck got swept in there during the flood. I'm gonna have to clear some to get inside. That would be bad. Imagine go. being stuck in there. Time to head in. Okay, let's see where this leads. God, talk about cutting it close. Jesus, say a lot. Oh, hey, bro. Take it easy. You must be Kentok. Oh. I was an outlander, not my name. Natika sent me to find you. The soldier you saved told us you were swept away by the mudslide. And so, he made it. Good. And... Natika. She came back. Yeah. She was on her way back to talk to you when the mudslide happened. She's looking after the survivors now. It was my mistake to deny her discharge. A soldier is supposed to sacrifice for the good of the tribe. Looking back now, she was right. 
I didn't want to let her go. The Chief's Guard will gain an invaluable soldier. At least after all this, I won't be in the way anymore. I can tell you know a fatal wound when you see one. My service to my clan is done. So... Leave me. No. You're not going to die down here. There has to be a way to get you out. There isn't. I tried to climb out, but it's no use. The walls are too slick. Try me, bitch. <laughs> Water's coming in from the surface. I can climb anything. Not from where I came in, there must be another source. My name's and if Aloy. I find it and open it up, you might not be able to move, Kentok, but I think there might be a way to move you. Hey, hey, I need you to stay awake. I'm gonna take a look around. <laughs> You're just like Natika. Relentless as a fire claw. And you should be used to it. Just sit tight. I'm going to get you out of here. Cool. That waterfall must be coming from somewhere. I need to get higher up to figure out where it's coming from. Let's see. Or the pilly willy. Oh, come on. You can make that. You can make that. Come on. Dead end. There must be another source. Oh, really? You didn't. You didn't just jump automatically. That's fine. Yeah. My controller died, not like this. We continue. Oh, this controller's nice and cool, not hot because I've been holding it forever. You were wondering what was going on there? What do you mean? What, when the controller? <laughs> oh, God, don't fall. There's some metal in that wall across the way. I'm able to pull some of it out. Again? This yeah. game hasn't crashed yet, though. hasn't crashed yet which is real it's rare but it's been working very well for us oh okay <laughs> saw down below should be coming in from somewhere around here. Gotta find its source. Drop. There's something down here. Nice. Very gen generous. What's down here? What's that? Doesn't look like anything too crazy. I just fell to my death. Water's coming in from there. I can use the fire for them to break open that wall. And this place Run, Aloy. It's gonna blow. Run. <laughs> hey, organized chaos. How's it going? And up he went. What did you do? Found us a way out. I'll 
almost there. Hey, stay with me. Tell Natika. You tell her yourself. She said you're a stubborn fighter, so keep fighting. Aww. Blade answers only to the hand that commands it. He would say that every time we sparred. Did he Sometimes die? Sometimes as an insult. No, why? Other times as a compliment. But I guess he was right. It was always my choice to stay or go. I'm sorry you didn't get to make amends. So am I. What will you do now? I'm not sure. Bleeding Mark has a chance to recover. And once that's done, I could join the Chief's Guard. But I have to lay him to rest first. With full soldier's honors. Aloy, wait. You saved my comrades, somehow drained the entire village. I want you to have this. Thanks. And good luck. Whatever you decide. Yay, we did it. What's the time? We can keep going. Um. Oh, wow. We have new armor. Damn. Oh, we should definitely put that on. That's great. And let's put on a weave. Yeah, we can definitely keep going. It's still early, bro still got ages okay um we've done that what's this taste of victory gather birds eggs that's the thing we need to do what was that even for the taste of victory thing a meal like no other i mean do i really care about the meal not really but <laughs> Fly to the mountain top. That would be cool. But we have to unlock the cauldrons first, I think. Tides. For some reason, I read that as titties of justice. <laughs> it says tides of justice, but I read it as titties. I need to get my head out the gutter, apparently. Um, okay, let's head towards our brand new places, which is like, holy crap. It's so far, dude. I think this is the closest we can get. No, we can actually go like all the way here. If we go to like Fall's Edge. <laughs> Titties of justice. <laughs> That's great. I love it. This has got to be a fireplace, surely. The heck was that? Damn, I just realized Aloy got her back showing now. Okay, she bear bear. Spot it. Gotta move. This is, uh, what is it? Don't hurt me, please. I don't want to fight. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's fire gleam. Right. Where is the fire gleam? I don't see it. Dude, chill. I'm not even attacking you right now. Where? I don't see it. It's not here. Weird. Okay, 
okay, well, I guess we're not doing that. Oh, that's definitely a fireplace. Let's head for that. Tits of justice. <laughs> Unite. Mighty Morgan boob power. Exactly. Just what I need. My stash. Yay. More berries. What the heck is that? I think I've already. I oh, know I haven't been there. Or have I? I feel like I have. I don't even know. Where is that? I oh, know I'm looking the wrong way. It's more that way. And have we been there? I'm so confused. It's past the mountains from the looks of things. Huh, weird. Maybe we haven't been there yet. Looks pretty cool. I love how this map is actually like 3D. It's really cool. Anyways, um, let's fast travel. Where are we going to go? I want to try and do this mission. Uh, but that's only for the birds, isn't it? For like the bird eggs, which eh, kind of isn't worth it. Whoa, hello. I don't think that's worth it. Nah, let's head for the main mission. We'll do that another time. We are going to head like here, I think. And then we can go through like that. It's going to be quite the trek. Or we could go through here. I think it would be more interesting to sort of go through here. Oh, no. Yeah, let's go through here. Because there's... Oh, my God. There's so much we can get distracted by, though. Actually, it's quicker to go here. I've already been all the way up here. Bro, I lose track of where I've been. Let's go along the top side. Because this is actually really close to where we want to go anyways. Let's find this rebel. Or let's um, complete this rebel outpost. This game can be overwhelming. Like, oh it God. is huge. It hurt I'd find them here. Oh my god, not Maybe you. Their leader might cause the rest to leave. Weak to ice. Electric chain reaction and weak to ice. I love the way you dive with this, it's so different. I want to get them to fight it. Or are they on its side? I don't know, it seems to be like... Attacking for them. The suit will be tough. That's gonna blow. Nice. They're attacking it as well, I think. How did they not attack it before? Oh, it's the fire. I'm gonna die. Oh, there we go. I said I'm gonna die. Freak it out, dude. I could not take all of them at the same time. That bitch was tough. Try again? We try again. I heard they were in the area. The best way to get rid of them is to take out their leader. I 
Oh yeah, I forgot you're weak to ice. Got him. Keep critical striking that bitch. Forget you. Oh my god. Where did you even go? Where are the others? Can you heal, please? <laughs> like just tapping his head, basically. God. What are you even waiting to? You're waiting to this? Firing out. Please stop, please. Just sent me attack. I need to use the smoke bomb. I can't see her. There we go. Leaders killed. This isn't a battle we're taking. What are you weak to? I mean, to be honest, it doesn't really matter. I just need to headshot you. Oh, what the freak? Oh my god. This fire is non-stop. Okay. Maybe we should come back here later. I gotta give it one more shot. I can't believe this bitch has killed me twice. I never die. The issue is I run out of ammo so quickly and then it's so difficult. Yeah, what I'm going to do, I'm going to leave this on the ice type. And then I'm going to use this for the initial shot. Frost ammo could help here. That's a chain reaction. And then just ice everywhere else, basically. I'm too far. Please hit that. Oh no. I wanted to hit the chain reactive part. Ugh. Use the ice. Hello? Aloy? Aloy? What are you doing, Aloy? <laughs> what the freak? What was that? Let's reload now. What the freak was that? That 
Alex. Take it closer. I'd shoot this more. Nice. I should check the leader's body. Seems like Captain. I should check if the leader has any tanks. Keep the ice guy. Oh my lord, Jesus. Come back here, you bitch. I need to check the leader for tax. Oh my god, shut up, Aloy. You're in the middle of a fight, my girl. What are you saying? What are you even talking about, brother? I need a precision bolt. Give me this. Sure, that works, but that's not actually what I wanted. Nice. Ice. Yes, we did it. Finally, you are the biggest threat, 1000%. Hi friends, how's it going? Um, Watch her movement. <sighs> nice, level thirty, hell yeah. That was awesome. Okay, now to not die to everyone else. I've got six. Oh my god, I didn't realize I had that many points. Um, we should increase something. <laughs> what that something is, I don't know. This looks cool. That looks really cool, the power one. We also need like more stamina, that would be nice. Okay, well, that's all we can do for now. Um, I need to craft some more. Now, what are all these people weak to? I should upgrade my crafting just so that I can do this quicker. Because it does take a while to do this. Okay. Where are the others? Did I kill him already? There's no way. Um, let's just kill you from here. Nice. There's one up there as well. I mean, you are fools, let's be honest. Ugh. Wasn't a headshot. I'm disappointed in myself. Oof. That even is the leader, because that's the only person we really care about. What? Headshot, headshot sign. Yes! Can't even quick save. Whoa! Just show your head, please. Ah, oh, mate. I think I hit the helmet. Yeah, where is the leader, I wonder? No one and nothing here. <laughs> nothing here must have been the win. You know what? Let's get close and let's just finish this. What are you weak to? Acid. Perfect. Let me up, please. There we go. Oh, okay. Sure, sure. Don't, don't use it. Fire anyone traveling down the mountain from this spot. 
under the rebel setup. You are... uh. Uh. Ow, you bitch. Oh, burrito. Okay, where's the outpost leader? Leader of the Reapers. That was fun. Going down. How did I even kill you? I don't remember killing you this one. Somehow they died. These tags. I'm gonna keep them for now until I figure out what to do with them. Cool. Um, that was great. So. Let's head to our actual objective. How about that? Um, let's follow this path and get some campfires on the way. Let's go. Is it this path? Yes, it is. I snap moors. I'm not bothering with you, so. Cool, there's a campfire. Let's head this way. Excuse me, sir. To kill hunters. I need animals, so I'm gonna go back and grab this. Oh, it's an owl. They didn't have anything interesting there. We need blue, green, or purple ones. Ideally. Hey, friends. Bye, friends. Now, what is this right here? Call and respond. Watchtower at the cold rushes. Sure. What's over here? There's the watchtower. I need to talk to their squad leader, Kiva. Hello. Are you Kiva? I am. And you. You're the outlander who killed Regala's champion at the embassy. Yeah, Ram squad was there. We saw your duel. Pavalo still owes me shards. Oh, thanks for the vote of confidence. Chaplain Jera sent me. It's time for you to go home. Jera's cracked then. There's no way our commander will allow us to leave our post. Not after our insubordination. Things have uh, changed at the bulwark. Dakota won't be able to stop you. Really? He's finally been taken down a notch? All right then. The last member of Ram Squad is on duty at the tower on the mountain. Let me recall him. That's odd. Ezeko always answers. One of us will have to go up. I can get up there easily. I'll check. Oh, that's a really cool Much horn sound. The start of the climb is just across the falls. Try not to break your neck, yeah? I'll do my best. Thanks for your concern. What's going on? We're moving out. <laughs> Back to the bowl. Oh, shit. What about Ezeko? Is this what I'm doing? What am I even doing? Let me um set the main quest to be what I'm actually like doing right now. Uh, it's a call and response. Yeah, this is what it is. I wonder how much snow can pile up. This must be the start of the climb. The watchtower should be at the top. More climbing. Let's go. <laughs> Sc 
sky drifters circling the watchtower. That's not a good sign. No, it is not. Probably everybody is dead. Gimme. Gimme, gimme. A man after midnight. Whoa. I'm full. That looks so cool. It looks like a light show. I'm getting closer to the watchtower. Looks like I have to climb higher. Looks like, yeah, this must be the way to go. I'm just following the snow. Here we go. This is giving me Skyrim vibes. When you climb up a tower, I gotta take like out this. these machines before I can look around. What are you weak to? Apex, no guys. Fire against that. Weak to ice. Perfect. That's chain reactable with acid. What? How did you spot me? Good job with the scanning. Okay, let's use ice, I guess. I miss all my shots. Good job. Why did they sound like bees? I need something that is resistant to fire. That would be real nice right now. This weapon is so slow. It hurts. Much better. I'm gonna presume that part is chain reactable with electricity. There we go. There we go. One more hit. You're not dead. I said one more hit. Oh. oh my lord. Oh shit. I have no berries. Okay. Woo. Okay. So why is the soldier assigned to this watchtower? I was about to die, man. I have no more berries. Because I have to use this potion for now. It must be him. Judging by these wounds, the Sky Drifter surprised him. At least it was quick. Kiva sounded her horn. It's a different call from before. I'd better get back down to the Watchtower and check on them. The Watchtower's under attack. I need to get down there fast. Time to glide. Of course I under attack. I leave you for one second. What happens? Swooping into battle. Those machines are in for a surprise. Oh, here we go. Blood of the Ten, the Outlander glides. <laughs> What are you weird to? 
fire. Interesting. Get wrecked. Dead. Nice. Oh, daddy chill. Oh, I can override it. I should totally override it. Let me override this one if I can. Of course you have to land up here. Oh well, I guess you're dead now. It's on fire. Now I can override it. Welcome to the theme, and you're dead. <laughs> Welcome to the team. That's not what I wanted. <laughs> I hacked it only for it to instantly die. That was great. Sup. I oh, sorry, you're not in the right position. Forgive me. No machine's too tough for Ram Squad. Thanks for the assist. Is the Zeko on his way down? Actually, he did. Machine's got him. Took him by surprise. I'm sorry. What? He was the first of the squad. Our best fighter. He's gone, Kiva. It's just the two of you now. Damn, Dakota. All we did was go to the embassy. Follow Chief Akaro's orders? A and what do we get for it? A death sentence dressed up as guard duty. All because Takote has a vendetta against the Chief. Well, that ends now. Yeah. Thanks, Outlander. Here. This is for you. Pavalo! We're moving out! Dakota is an underhanded jerk. But maybe now he'll stop wasting lives over political agendas. Ooh, new face mask. Nice. Face mask, face paint, pog. Okay, let's fly down. Great place to glide. Acid claw strider site. Around. I wonder what it's got in that container on its back. <sighs> I guess I kill you. Why not? side is explosive interesting but i can barely hit that it's very difficult to hit it hi friends oh not these oh no another one jesus nice that was explosive as hell Nice, nice, nice. Can I get out of water? That would be great. Oh my god. I could have overrided you. Okay, that's really not what I want. How many enemigos are there? Jesus, what are you? You're probably weak to ice. And there's acid ones. Who knows what they're weak to? Oh 
my god, so many. Wheat and water, interesting. I'm out. I'm out, lovely. You know what? I need to set some traps up, honestly. I think traps I completely underutilize and actually need to use more often, and I'm dead. Nice. <laughs> I need to stop fighting these random groups, honestly. I just. I, I need to collect parts so that I can override them, so I need to fight them enough. Oh, that's annoying. Eh. I say we head for the main missions. <laughs> Screw these side missions where I'm fighting these enemies that I'm never going to be. Oh, those are interesting. I don't think I've ever seen these enemies, though. So it doesn't like purge water. Sunwing. I can't wait to fly one of these. Ah, oh, you're weak to that. Interesting. It's too fun fighting these though. Like seriously. How can I not fight them when they're so much fun to fight? There we go. Now what are you weak to? You're weak to the same thing as are you, I think. This is the apex one. Let me reload before we engage in this fight. How do I? Oh, I can't change it yet. We did it just in time. Nice. Nice. Why does this sound so much like a blood one sort of thing? I swear they actually use the same sound effects. It's so similar. Need more ammo. Ah shit. Um Let me do this. Nice. Run away. No, no, don't climb. Drop, drop, jump off. Thank you. Freaking hell, man. Oh my god. Oh my lord, I'm gonna die. We'll place a trap there, because why not? Oh my lord, I'm actually going to die. Did I get one of them with my trap? Hell yeah. Sorry for the freak out, but it's really annoying when you're dying unnecessarily, i got to say. What are you weak to? Why am I even facing you? That's detachable. Chain reaction. Okay. With electricity. Could you not? That would be freaking great if you could not. Oh, these apex creatures, I can't even, man. 
I can't even. Not after all that. Brother. That's ridiculous. We died after all that. Okay, we're, we're not doing this again. No. No, no, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> that was so long. Why is this area so difficult? What level do you have to be to face these things? I'm clearly under leveled or something like that. Yeah, that was tough, man. Um, maybe I need to do these side missions first. Because that's a lot of XP. That would be quite nice. And a new bow. And that's also a lot of XP. Where is this show map? It's all the way there. So either way. I say we just run through and ignore. <laughs> I hate it. No, three times the charm. You got to give it at least three attempts. Oh my God. Is that a freaking bear? No, I'm not going there. Um, at least three attempts. If we fail the that attempt, then yeah, we're done for. What I will do actually, rather than equipping this hunter one, I'm going to equip the survivor one. Because honestly, I need to just heal myself out of nowhere um we'll find the apex ones and deal with them first none of these are apex oh great now we have a bear here apex ravager Can I override you? <laughs> oh, this is scary. Are you good? Wait, you're good? What? Oh, it's good. Well, we can set this free and it will help us. That would have been nice to know. I set it free. Oh, not happy to see me? Wait, wait, wait. Just let me open this. Before you attack me, let me open this. Okay, awesome. Thank you for waiting. Oh, it's not friendly. I just snuck in when I wasn't meant to. Oh, you're freaking kidding me, brother. <laughs> oh, that's great. I can override these? Okay. That is useful to know. I can even mount it. Um, what are you weak to? Oh, I'm gonna die. Let me use my R1 version of it. Power Shredder, hell yeah. Nice, let's use this thing. I can't even see right now. What is going on? Um, you're weak to this, right? Oh. Let's uh, heal up. Where are you? There you are. Did you not? That would be great. Oh my god, stop. Stop. Chill out, buddy. Oh my god. I've got no more health. 
I need to use a potion. This swing is so annoying. I gotta wait. Build up my stamina. Oh no. Not you. Not you. I did not need to deal with you as well. If I'm able to defeat all of these guys, hell yeah. But I don't think I am. Large potion? Okay, we're fine. Just about. Why don't you help me, bro? Yeah, that's right. F them up. F them up, yeah. One at a time. Hell yeah. Gotcha. Nice. What the freak? Okay. Yes. I'm gonna die. This is not good. I'm gonna die. Oh no, we have small health potions. This was the best thing I could have ever done. Question mark. Nice. What the freak? Why is this so powerful? It's doing decent damage. Well, decent. Very mildly decent. Damn it. <coughs> I should never gasp like that. That ruined my fight. <coughs> okay, well, I said three times a charm. That's it. <coughs> failed battles, failed battles. Damn, that sucks. Anyways, I think we'll leave it there for today. What's the time? It is like half midnight. We're still nowhere near. I mean, we have progressed a lot, considering it took us so long to do this section. To get through all of this, like, we have done a lot. There's still missions literally all over the place. And I'm like, maybe I should do some offline, but nah. We'll continue to just work through on stream, I think. But yeah, thank you very much if you were just watching for Horizon Forbidden West. I hope you enjoyed. And until our next playthrough, this is Goldcat signing out. Peace.